Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel and welcome back to some more Word of Wyvern playthrough Road Tech Streaming. Where today we will claim our first heavy mech. So in the other playthrough I've got, which is about 80 days behind, so not too not as far as I thought was behind. But it's behind. I've already got two heavy mechs. Two very good heavy mechs. So, let's see if we can get one today. We're ready to drop. We're ready to go. I don't think there's anything else I need to do. No, we are going straight into a fight. We're going to go with some higher skull missions. That's a duo duel. Could we do a duo duel? Do we have mechs that can do it? I mean, the Ashran could potentially do it, but would also potentially get blown to pieces. Yes, I think the... Is it the Morrigan? Yeah, you're very good with laser cutting. And I think the Procyons could potentially do it. So let's have both of them try it. We're going to be fighting a heavy mech. And that is good, I would say. Well, we're going to be fighting two heavy mechs. Hmm. Do I want more random salvage? I think we do on this one occasion because we'll see what we get yeah let's see what we get i don't think we've got the best vehicles have we uh oh something i don't know we'll load the clear something may have changed i can't remember if there's been an update or not i think there might have been chronos what are you running MRMs and ER large. So yeah, the Morrigan. And Majestic. And the Procyons. And Wow herself. Word of why then that is. Let's go. Let's have some fun. Let's kick some ass. And I hope everyone is having a lovely day. Let's see if we can kick this stream off. Lovely, maybe. Perfectly. We shall see. So, I'm going to have to try and get around behind them, which is not impossible. I think we can I think we can get round behind. And, and gang up as well. Lots of laser fire incoming. From me, that is. Normally I go for money on this only. And one choice pick and that's it. But this might be one of those rare occasions where we want more random salvage to try and get the, the parts of heavy mechs. Potentially. It's taking a long time to load. Don't like that. How can it take so long to load four mechs? Is there a duel in the city? Maybe. Could well be. I'm going to have to look and see if there's any missions whether, where there's... Um, Titan missions, Clash of the Titans and stuff like that. Because that is going to be something that we Reactor really need. Online. There we go. Sensors We're in. Online. Weapons online. Although, nominal. Assault makes might be a little bit out of our league, but interface. we can only try. That is a Zeus and a Warhammer. Ooh, we could be in trouble. Let's do this. 
Hmm. Is eight evasion the most we get? It looks like it is. We'll go there. On my way. Double time. And they disappear. So we're gonna go active without ECMing. Yes, Commander. Yeah, you're a little bit slower. Go All there. Right, let's move. And it is Zeus X. That's not good. And that is a Warhammer. Right. So that's an assault mech. Standing by. I don't necessarily want to go over that hill just yet. So let's reserve. And again. Roger that. Standing by. That's good. AMS is working. Might as well let the Zeus go as well. Let's go to the mineral field over there. That's not the Come worst thing. Because I can go... Ooh, can I... I can't... I can get behind the... This guy. But I don't get a hitch... don't get to see my hit chance. So let's go there. Just move... That's a good hit chance. With he's got a stealth bubble around him, he seems to be confirmed. Not very stealthy, and that was pretty good damage to the leg. I'm here. Mm, I have to sprint this, and I want to sprint this. Let's go. Target locked. I feel like we may have picked off. Uh, Warhammer is about sh is more trouble than the Zeus. I mean, it has machine guns, so yes, it is more trouble. Minimal damage. But it's shut down. What? Good to go. Well, now we're clearly going it all in on him. Yes, I'm Sacrificing there. a bit of evasion. Firing at enemy six. Uh, composite destroyed, XL gyro Critical crit. Hit, okay, that's fine. I have a feeling you're going to go for the Procyons. No. That's a, that's a heavy gauss. That's going to rip things off us. Waiting for orders. Let's deal with this guy quickly then. Order acknowledged. We'll have him dealt with now. Copy that, commander. There he goes. Target down. How are you doing, Joseph? And I'm receiving. I'm thinking Initiative for you, 14. You're 14 as well. Mm. Let's go there. Affirmative. I don't know if this is going to do all that much. Not really. But he will stay in that mineral field. No. Splash damage. Okay. AMS is jammed by the looks of things. That's not the worst thing in the world. Standing by. Aha, I can get to the mineral field now. Roger that. No shooting. Just I'm toasty. Running. I'm rather toasty. Let's turn the medium laser and those two off to cool down. So we've got an alpha strike should we need it in a moment. Right, doesn't ha I think it just has damage reduction. I'm just not sure what for. Might as well go to the mineral field as well. I should have gone a little bit closer for the lasers, but never mind. Let's go Vigilant. It doesn't give us any damage reduction, but it gives us higher initiative next turn. Okay, the arm is taking some damage. Hopefully we're inside in range for the Gauss. But not the other things. I'm doing very well. How's it going? Very well indeed. That is... A kick up the butt for him. And we can go all in. 55% chance to make him unsteady. He's gone for this round. Let's let's go for that. We miss, so we get no evasion. So we could be screwed. We could well be screwed. But this could save us. We got 17 initiatives, so we'll gain some of it um invasion back, hopefully. Engaging. That's a connection. Yes, 
Yes, right, I think I will go for evasion. On my way. Um, yeah, I'm going to risk going over heat. Target lock on. And we got him! Yay! He had an XXL Target engine, I believe. Life. We're good. Mission Let's see what's left of them. I don't know if I want the Zeus X, because I probably won't see too many of them. Well, too many mechs to take parts of it in the near future. But Warhammer parts wouldn't be too bad. But I don't like Warhammers in Rogue Tech, because they're pretty terrible on stuff. There's only one part of it left anyway. Okay. Ooh. There is Battle Computer Heat. Mm, weapon Mount Heat. I've got one of those already. That's coming from the Warhammer. Oh, it's a Warhammer X. Coming with wrist thickness. So it had hyper lasers. Oh. Yeah, I can't take the whole Zeus, but... Double XL engine. ATM-12. Snubnose Heavy Gales Rifle. Too heavy for what we're currently running, but... Wouldn't be a bad thing to take. I think I'll disassemble that anyway. I'm thinking the Battle Computer Heat might help us right now. Hang on. What the hell is this? Headshotter 2000. Is this a quick sell item? Because it doesn't look like it's going to be. Improves cool shot mo location modifier by 23%. For all weapons mounted in the equipped location. Weighs 2% of the mech's total mass. 2% base failure chance on activation and each and each turn until deactivation. Chance of failure is reduced by 0.1 per piloting. So if you've got 10 pilots in, it would be 1% fail chance per. Uh, injuries pilot on failure does not critical hit to a... Oh, deals critical hit to a component in the same location on failure can hit self item is always active and cannot be deactivated manually okay so if it's always active you've always got that one percent you need to so the longer the fight goes on the higher the fail chance so if you've got a 10 round fight by 10 rounds you've got 10% chance of it failure. 20 rounds, 20% chance. I don't know if that's good. Cold shot modifier to the location of 23% is very good. I think we're going to have to take it and give it a try. And see what other random stuff we get. Because there's a few things here that I would like. But we shall see. We get a Zeus part. Armored cow. We got one. I'll get rid of that. Multi tracker, basic ECM. I'll keep it for now. And patchworks and fire control mark two is not too bad. We didn't get any of the battle computers, sadly. What is that equipment though? That is very new. I like it, but it's definitely not going on any builds for the moment. But eventually, there will be a mech that will be taking that. Can we make the perfect 100% headshots build? Because that would be glorious if we could. Well, that was nice and quick, nice and simple. Didn't really take too much damage. So we can go in again. And yeah, two days and we are ready to go. Job's done, Commander. Right, well, that were quick. Uh, have we got anyone here that we are thinking about? No. No one too high, really. Okay, so that was a duo duel, and we did well. I'm actually thinking we do the escort and see what we can get here. But, yeah, we need we need heavy max. I'm thinking four and a half, five skulls is too much for us, but it's not, because the the, the game has changed and the difficulty has changed. So, we've just seen an 80-ton an 80 mech in a five-skull duel. I think that's fairly rare for that to happen. Um, that's decimated remains. 
I also just want to see if there's any... I mean, that one's probably very good, but there's a lot on the battlefield for that. Um, none of these seem to be... Titan matches. Do they not exist anymore? Or... No, I guess not. Let's go for a four and a half skull escort in the desert. All the salvage. And let's see how this goes. So, definitely want these two. Then what? I kind of do want the Ashwang. And Strider. It does put out Daka, and that's good. So, these are all mech slots, yes. I can't remember what's what. Ultra 2, Ultra 2, Thunderbolt 10, ER medium lasers. Hmm. Kronos is the MRM build. I'll take you with Vor. Scorpion is a terrible build. It needs to be reworked, but we will get there. Um, it is a very good mech otherwise. What are you? Uh, yeah, we've just been through you. You're the machine gun build. Uh, Owens, I think we want you. SRMs with acid. And that's it. Anubis doesn't actually... Oh. Ah, Jelly Roll can go in at the Anubis. And it would be good. Possibly. I mean, it gets the 20 affinity straight away, which is always good. 40 plus 1 defense. It's not bad. Kit Fox... Fox, Kit Fox, Kit Fox is streaks. Let's go for you and the Owens. So Hunter there. I'm pretty sure in a previous playthrough, Hunter was one of my tank pilots, which is confusing me. And two vehicles. Well, we'll go for the two biggest. Pathfinder. And Dark Helmet. There we go. So, Battle Armor. Do I have... Yeah, you can't go in Battle Armor. Also, what do we want? Light Rifles? Machine Guns? I think we're missing a Machine Gun with you. I think. Uh, Cutter Tours, Grenade Launchers, and ECM on you. And... Partial wing systems and flamers. You know what? We'll take you in. Oh, that's how we do it, yeah. Well, can I have battle armor? Okay, why will I have the slot then? Codon has the battle armor mounts. Okay, maybe it can with. Uh, no, no, we can't modify them in any way. Well, we have um, the kit fox. Let's give it to the kit fox then. I think I only have one battle armor pilot at the moment. Yes, I do need to look for more. So, let's go. It's one skull below what our large rating is. That's fine. I think we're good with that. I think we will be okay. Hopefully we see some heavy mechs in this. And I'm hoping to take one in one piece, but I'll take pieces and build it the expensive way if I have to, to get my first one. Let's see which way we get it. 
I mean, pieces of an Omni mech doesn't really make much difference because obviously we're just taking out the broken weapons. All the engine and that is there. It's obviously battle mechs that are the expensive ones to build. I keep forgetting what day it is. It's Sunday. I will make you laugh today. I had a bit of a, um, well, a drinking problem today. It was a bad day. I went to the cinema and took my first sip of the... Ended up being a large drink. I didn't intend to buy a large drink. But as I took a sip of it, I tried to tip it up and take a sip out of the straw. And as I did that, because I was thinking, I don't know, just tried to drink out of it as a like a normal cup and take a sip out of the straw at the same time i end up pouring the drink down myself yeah so i had to sit through the entire movie with slightly soggy pants luckily they dried by the end of the movie so i didn't look like i'd wet myself with excitement through the movie yeah so that that's my stupid thing for the day Ah, it's not every day you make a fool out of yourself, but at least it was in complete darkness and everyone was focused on the screen to see what was going on. Yeah, oh boy. It's not my smartest move, it's not my smartest moment, but hey, the movie was good and the drink was good, what was left of it. It wasn't too much I spilled, it was just weird that I you know, poured it down myself. Uh, I saw Ghostbusters. Frozen something? I'm gonna say Frozen Kingdom. That's not right. Is it Frozen Kingdom? It's Frozen something. But I quite liked it. It was. It had all of the stupid moments that you'd expect, kind of thing, to. You know, give those nostalgic moments to older people. And it was still quite funny. And Paul Rudd is a brilliant actor, and I don't normally like kids with kids in, in movies or actors, kids as actors. Partly because there's been quite a few that have been complete whiny little children. I just don't like children, apparently. But no, the the, the actors that were the kids in this were very good. The same the same ones from the last one. I cannot remember the name of Eva by the set my, at the moment. Command interface initiated. Oh, what do I see? I see a blockading force. No. I'm seeing more and more blockading forces. And I also see that we um get the get three lances because of that. Also, we can't drop anywhere but on them. Right, well, let's not trigger this straight away. I think that's a must. And it looks like we're only going to there anyway. But yeah, that is a Anzu. A Mantis. A mobile PDS. No. That looks like a World War I tank. Also, also... It's got um, side sponsors from Warhammer 40k. But yeah, that is a weird ass tank. I like it. No World War One style and Warhammer 40k style. It's both good. And yeah, Mantis, very weird. Very odd. I'm receiving you. Let's make sure that we don't go into the Confirmed. objective. We also have a phalanx. Double ballistic. Okay. Interesting. Yes, Commander. Uh, yeah, five evasion. Go there. Oh, I should have gone active with you. Ready for orders. Oopsie. I got a ping. That's right. The Ashwang does have a ping. Coordinates received. Hmm, I should use that to get rid of your stealth. Yes. Don't care so much about the evasion. 
The Mantis will catch later on, hopefully, or very early on when it maybe doesn't have as much evasion. But at the moment, getting rid of this guy's self is way more important. Uh, you might actually stay yep. mounted for this engagement. Because I don't want to have to drag you around the battlefields for too long. Uh, Owens, let's get six evasion. Go there. On my way. Ready for orders. Searchlight on. You see I'm active. Calculating. Position confirmed. Done. What do you need? I copy. I'm probably not move spread out spreading out enough, but Receiving you. I think we'll be okay. Coordinates received. I think we're gonna have to be very aggressive with this guy. With the PDS. Evening Adam! How are you doing on this glorious Sunday afternoon? If you can tell it's a Sunday afternoon. Waiting for orders. I mean, that's good. I can even turn the missiles off on you. So... Could I not get into your side? Apparently not. You know what? I'm going to go this side. I'm going to go here. All right. Let's move. Turn those off because they're completely pointless, but there's a lot of a lot of uh, AMS. Not much armor though, which is good. EJ You're at work? No. I've got Let's work tomorrow, so I will be in your boat. Your work boat. Yeah, let's kick. All lasers, cut him down. Engaging. Let's see how that goes. It went well. That went well. Ready for orders. Hmm. If I go there, it's reasonable. I may stray fire a little bit. But hopefully not too much. And copy that. Got him. Good. One last target. We did stray fire. Lol, relaxing in a in a tub. Hope my back quits hurting before tomorrow. No, why is your back hurting? I, I vaguely remember you might have said or I sh or that I should know. Uh, commander? Uh, ultra light rotary rifles might want to Stack of the crap out of the Mantis while we can. Oh, yeah, 55%. Let's do it. Let's go. Four shots. In all weapon systems. Not bad. Not too bad. But your rogue tech is doing well. Hunting Clan Coyote and Clan Baruch for the sweet Coyote Society gear. Don't get me started on that because I'll want What's it. Up, and I'll want all of it. And currently, getting hold of a heavy mech is a challenge. A okay, I want to finish this guy off considering he's open. I bet you're gonna like Not this. quite, but you know what, I think I'll leave him for later now. Commander. Standing by. Ooh, let's uh, get the streaks on the back of this guy. He didn't move, so we, we should be able to hit him, right? Enemy outflanked. Oh, we've got more AMS. In the Anzu. Double AMS by the looks of things. Yes, boss. Well, if nothing else. If nothing else, we can on the move. burn up some of his AMS. On it. A few shots got through. Fine. Uh, what map am I playing? Uh, this is... Uh, des it's not the desert. Desert one. And yes, hello, Ferguson. What are they? They don't call it desert, do they? 
It's a hot biome, basically, but not Martian. Commander. Hmm. I'm thinking. Heading out. The tandem, the crap out of this tank. Sniper artillery cannon. What? That's got artillery. Oh, I'm playing 3080s. Sorry. 3080s map. Uh, map. So that's why my map looks really weird and there's not actually that many factions. Uh, you're on the way to clan country. I just got to work through Cappy country and Drax too. Yeah, Draconis Combine gives you some good stuff. Although, not so much early on. Confirm. Mm, engine crit, good, but if... Critical hit, Commander. AMS didn't kill 13 missiles, then we would have got it. Yeah, I'm after, way after the clan invasion. So, I can go find clan tech. No! Okay, that was really bad. That was bad. Oh, sniper artillery cannon can fire banged up pretty good. the turn, Reporting that turn. Major armor loss. Or was that always Taking there? No, because they can't. I'm under heavy fire. Watch my six. Well, that sucks. That truly sucks. I've lost an ultra light. Advanced time. Advert time. Yeah, sorry. Yes, I am after the clan invasion. Am I 12 million this weekend? I'm guessing sea bills. Standing by. Ah, I've lost something. Well, I may be able to get another one. To be fair, it's probably a bit too explosive. We're lucky that we're only losing an arm, not the entire mech. Affirmative. Standing by. So... I think... Yeah, you're open, so let's see if we can drop you. I oh, know your arm's open at the back, sorry. Target lock on enemy's rear. LBX is crit, though. That's what hit me hard. Waiting for orders. Toga. If I'd have finished this guy off, we wouldn't have lost the arm. That's all I'm saying. Firing all weapons. Why did I get him from the back? His side was open. Waiting for orders. Not having a great moment there, am I? On my way. All right, don't go boom. That kind of boom is fine, but a um. One less target. Core meltdown boom would have been really bad. Good to go. Uh, you can do nothing. That's fine. Roger that. Venting heat and stable. <laughs> you wish I had 12 million IRL. Yes. I think everyone would be happy with 12 million, but then there's say some fine. people that wouldn't be happy with 12 million. Right. Let's go. Yeah. See, if we'd have got one more missile through the last round, we would have got the phalanx. Fine. Go again. Firing full complement on enemy. Sniper ammo explosion. Hostile so they can fire the turn. That turn. You don't have to wait a turn for the artillery to Receiving come down. Him. Hmm. Interesting. Roger. I don't even take out the arm. Reporting. Take out the upper arm. Most of those missiles were intercepted. Moving to position. Giving them everything I've got. LBX has crit again and again. Critical hit. He gets to go. He's going to hit someone hard, unfortunately. Please don't be the Ashwang. Ooh, light PBC with twin link capacitor. And you're a bit toasty now. Oh, what a yes, shame. Commander. Right. Kick in the butt. Heading out. He's unsteady. But Time not God. How big is an Anzu and how much armor does it have? Yes, Commander. I'm gonna go with it's a heavy mech. Or at least a rather 
50, 60 ton mech. There goes the leg. There goes the mech. Advanced optics destroyed. Never mind, they're not the be end, be and end all of everything now. Uh, he was going to brace. He's going to stay on the mech for the moment. Toga, you can trigger this. And brace. And receiving you. Yeah, let's get everyone moving this way. Copy that. Standing by. Jump. Not that, it, not that it truly helps in all fairness, but hey. Good to go. Acknowledge. Alright. So we have to go down there next. Commander. It'll be interesting to see if there's a On the move. Wave when we activate here, because if there is, I think from what I've seen, we might be fighting three lances all the time in these missions. Also, I don't necessarily want you in the fight now, because you're a little bit broken. Let's move. Good to go. Move order received. Uh, I haven't got 12 million yet, but I'm getting not far off it. And then monthly finances come around. Mech warriors. Show them yeah, what reinforcements. So there's, it looks like in these missions, they made it harder by always having three lances. I'm here. Which isn't exactly the worst thing in the world. It, make, it makes it a little bit more of a challenge. Especially early on. Yes, Commander. Uh, no, you can do nothing still. Affirmative. Weird. We've got. Uh, that empty. Let's do this. How very random. Full speed. Right, what we're we'll seeing a Thunder and a Kronos. So Kronos is 55 tons. Thunder is in the heavy department. They've both got a um They've both got What you call it? ECM. Interesting. So Receiving you. We kinda need to keep the Ashbank in the fight. Aye aye. Yeah. What can I do you for? Do do do. All on air. Oh, there's also a catapult too with more stealth. Well, that sucks. Giving them everything I've got. Tagged it. That's good. So you have a stealth lance. Lovely. You know what, this mission might end up being a failure because facing three separate lances of Catapult 2s and Thunderers and stuff like that Good to go. isn't going to work out for the best. Okay, we're going to go there. On the move. Uh, I mean, it gets two of them, so that's not so bad. Sensor lock. Let's see who what goes next. So you've just been both of these two. Didn't do anything annoyingly. If I'd have waited, I'd have got you, um, you in. Apparently, you have no weapon systems working. That might be the weirdest ever. For orders. Potentially. Confirm. Um, I'm going to go there because you're rather hot. Confirm. And therefore easier to hit. Waiting for orders. You're way too slow. Go tandem. Let's go improved. Alpha strike. I don't technically need to actually shoot you too much because 
you've got no offensive weapons. Waiting for orders. But also need to shoot you at some point, and that was the only target, so why not? Uh, have we got incendiary? Yes, we do. Oh, TSEMP cannons on a 70 ton catapult. Interesting. So they're both 70 ton catapults. Yeah, the Ashwang is too volatile. And also, I have no idea what you were running, but that is... It's the same. LRM-20 TSEMP cannons. Nice 70 tonners, but... We've just lost a pilot. And a mech. And in all fairness, I think... There's an arrow coming in that we can't escape from. Awesome. Well, things go boom. LBX2 carrier. I mean, that's a pretty good hit chance. Laser carrier. Well, might as well. Not the worst. Uh, no, it wasn't headshot it was a ammo explosion which ripped the entire mix to pieces okay they're all carriers and they're all in an artillery strike which i can't no i wouldn't be able to avoid because um engaging target because i can't because they're um because they have to stay in coherency so we're gonna get Arteed, basically. I'm receiving you. You can get out. Copy so that. that's what you're running. You're running um, arrows. Well, let's see if we can face shoot you. Acknowledged. Nope. Let's see if we survive. Orders. Um. Yes, yeah, go there. Confirmed. Nothing. Commander. Morrigan. I wonder if we take out this guy before he drops his artillery. Does he still Putting come down? We'll find out in a second if we manage to take him out. We don't take him out, sadly. Yeah. Uh, uh, go there. On my way. Go here. Roger. Add a little bit more heat with a flamer. Let's do this. Yeah, you need to sprint. Let's go. See if we can get you in the face. We did, and he punches out, so that is actually a full mech on the loot table. Should we survive go. this? I mean, that's a charge. We don't want to charge. I'll make them dead. Tagged. That was actually quite terrible. Damage minimal. I was expecting more, if I'm honest. Now you figure out the quickest way to get rid of battle armor. Badger APCs with, I want to say, six to eight small laser melts them quickly. Ooh. Ow! That, yeah, we're gonna lose a striker as well. What do you need? Awesome. Managing heat. Did he just fire on himself, or did he straight fire? He may have straight fired the hunter. I think he did. Good to go. Well, Location let's fire through control. everything. Giving them everything I've got. Let's get this done. It's not bad. Critical hit, Commander. Warning. Armor low. That should be a boom. No, Emily, we might actually do this. Uh, big boom bomb run. No, arrow four. Come down. 
on my face. Well, on the whole mech. All weapons committed. These aren't All weapons too bad, to be fair. I'm under heavy fire. Uh, a bit of uh, stray fire. Whoopsie. Um, what else we got? Sam, standards. Let's go standards. Mech warriors, show them what you there got. There was some. Well, it was a good what shot from this order? guy to shoot his friend, to shoot me, even. Uh, what are we doing? Let's go there. Acknowledged. Good to go. Go boom! Target down. I um, don't often see many Badger APCs, so... I have to keep an eye out, out for them. But if you can get a mech with small lasers, it's pretty good. On it. Uh, a bit toasty. Fine, I'm going to not fire those to cool down. Got it. Thunderer is not going to go boom, sadly. Receiving you. See, I'm kind of underwhelmed again by artillery. Coordinates received. Because this guy's got no evasion. The uh, the arrow four did nothing. Affirmative. I get the impression that artillery is a nothing thing anymore, and we're just not gonna Commander. be using it later on. Locking on target. So this turn, he will most likely fire his arrow. Or set the shot up. And that's it. Yeah, there's the arrow coming down. Yes. Now we get to find out if we take him out, does the, ar the does the uh. artillery still come down? Reporting negative See, he has streak sixes, which would actually be worse. No, if you take the mech out, the artillery does not come down. Interesting. Uh, did a tank start and gave me one start? Ah, so that's a pretty good thing to start with. Commander. That is not a bad start, then. Waiting for orders. Yeah, Striker's out of this fight because... I don't want to lose you as well. Yes, Commander. Um, race you until this Confirm. next Holding. engagement, I think. It's having it's, it's annoying having these guys spread over two squads now for whatever reason. Or the drop over here, so let's wait around here for them. Um... Same with you. Coordinates received. Bonus. On the move. Everyone gets closer. Confirmed. Position confirmed. But you, you get further away. And this is where they drop at the other side. Right, we're going to dismount you. Hey, look at that. We get a bit of movement with jump jets. Right, next turn, everyone's in. Okay, we'll just move back and forth. Order acknowledged. Moving to position. Position confirmed. Hide there. Aye, aye. Get you there. On it. 
Get you over there now. On my way. Oh yeah. Jump to the right. trees. And get you in. Hold this position, Commander. Are you kidding me? They're Package way the over there. That's not clever. Well, if they come over there, we got them. So there's a Gallo Glass, a Star Slayer, a Talon, and a... Hecon... Yeah, uh... he -cats. We'll call it a he -cat. Um I kind of want to keep some of you active. Come on, people. Let's make it happen. Well, we lost the Chronos. The, is it the Chronos? Whatever it was. The Ashwang. It would have been a good build, but I completely, completely lost it. Standing by. Well, it was a good build. We just... Yeah, they were too volatile. Roger. Not enough armor on the mech for what it was running. And how it was running it. But otherwise... They weren't that scary, the mechs that we were facing. They just got lucky and stripped off enough armor. And Strider's dead. Sorry! First casualty. Receiving you. Oh, can get some line of sight. Target confirmed. Did 14 damage. Standing by. I've not actually managed to do, or not chosen, a uh, tank star yet, so I might choose one as a, as sort of the next start when that is forced upon us. Orders. Ah, yes, and you're a million miles away. Engaging jump jet. I'm here. Same as you. Going full throttle. Aye, aye. I'm doing exactly much better. Roger. Oh, went for you. Whoopsie. Never mind. Waiting for orders. At least you can still fire into all this. We have incendiaries to set the forest on fire. We do. Structure exposed on this tank. Light damage, Commander. We're about to lose one of them. Armor breached. Internal damage. So let's go there and return serve. All weapons. Straight into the back of my Morrigan. Yeah, you can't move. Stabilizing. Engaging coolant system. You can't move. More incendiary. You're an entirely um, energy build, so. Show what you got. That'll cook you a little bit. Confirmed. Taking the shot. Done. Commander. Let's sprint past everybody. To some degree, at least. No shooting, just running. And. Dude, not much in the way of Roger. ammo left. Interesting. Standing by. Alright. Oh, did I see you have battle armor on you? No, no, sorry, the star slayer is just right behind him. I copy. Uh, 
Yes, Commander. Right, let's see if we can keep you hot. Firing all weapons. And got you on steady. Yes. Order. Aha, mm. there we go. All weapons are go. Straight fire into the back of the Procyons. Waiting for orders. I don't think the battle arm is going to get into this, we go. if I'm honest. Nope. I think they're out of it. Good to go. I'll find uh Yeah, might as well go there. Hit you again. Not that we do too much because you're gonna get activation before too long. So we might Target locked in. cut him up. Oh, yeah. No. No, sadly oh. not. Alright, you're not doing anything. Stabilizing. Engaging coolant system. Ah, uh, you got steady, but. We'll hit you. Yeah, you can't do anything. Stabilizing. Engaging coolant system. You can't see anything. Oh, damn, let's do this. Waiting for orders. Let's go there. Acknowledged. Come on, people. Let's Not make quite a happen. boom. Critical hit, Commander. My LRMs are out. Hmm, this could be suicide. Position confirmed. Let's take the Gala Glass away. Taking the shot. Hell, yes. No, just take out the arm. Target taken a critical hit. I'm here. Uh, yeah, you're getting there. My next. Mission, you'll be in the fights. Good to go. Yeah, sprint you, get Copy a little that. bit of distance. So, tandem? Affirmative. Ooh, got him in the face. Just no injury, sadly. Ready for orders. On my way. Firing. More damage. They're not doing anything, weirdly. Waiting for orders. Very Understood. weird, very annoying. This guy should probably go now. Oh, he wasn't running an XL engine. Solid connection on that one. Standing by. And that may well be the end of him. It is. See, even way back there, he's doing well. Six, destroy. Yes, Commander. And on the Star Slayer. No, we're gonna go for you. Ultra ten, sixty-five ton heavy. Engaging with target. He's not firing, so I'm not worried about him at the moment. He will start firing, most likely. No. He's done nothing. That was completely fresh mech. Well, near enough. Why are they not... Why? Stabilizing. Engaging coolant system. Weird. Stabilizing. Engaging coolant system. You can technically move. Got one shot in, I believe. And 55% on you. Let's go for it. 
Gabriel! Do we have a boom counter for tonight? We do. One. I've lost the Ashwang. It's gone. It went boom spectacularly. Talon's 35 tons. Good to go. And we missed the kick. Never mind. That's a miss. Mech warriors, show them what you got. And maybe something that we add in, a boom counter. Hmm. We did open this guy up. Let's do this. I don't think we're going to be able to follow up with that in any way. Not from behind, anyway. Affirmative. Am I getting too toasty? Here we go. Ah, straight fire on Procyons again. I am out of SRMs. Standing by. Morrigan. Yeah, we'll kick you in the butt. Mr. Hockentantius. High level critical. He knows what's coming. Kithox. Go point blank on this guy. Large laser's gone. He hasn't fired it, so it makes no real difference. It was fun while it lasted. It was the mech with the primitive rotaries. Yes. Six ultralight rotary rifles. Blown past my armor. Yeah, there was no real way of keeping it, unfortunately, and that is not great yes, come in. either. Owens. Can you get uh, you can't really get a melee and we can, ooh, we are actually a stalemate. We can't move anywhere because of him, so he has to go down one way or another. We'll have put acid on him actually. Targeting for physical attack. So he's blocking the path to, for me to get reinforcements through to my other mechs. But he's now open, so Critical hit I don't command. think he's going to last too much longer. Orders. <sighs> Stupid battle armor. I dismounted them too quickly. What do you need? And... Yeah, let's see if we can take you out. Taking the shot. Let's hit him hard. Jump jet's gone, so that's not so bad. Got past his armor. They have, they have literally fired one salvo, I think, and that's it. One at one one shot at me. That is a back strike. We'll take that. Firing all weapons. Gyro crits. Heat sinks crits. Inflicted some heavy from damage. The far side of the world. Yeah, I don't think we'll salvage anything of the Ashwang, sadly. Again, why are you not fire? I mean, I don't mind that you're not firing. But I do find it really bugged, I guess. You can't do anything. Have I got them that scared they don't want to fire? So I find that hard to believe. Right, which... Ah, we can shoot you in the back, can't we? Kaboom! Oh, Cornell down! My heat sinks can't vent fast enough. I'm, I'm taking damage. And the red light. Heat damage. Yeah, the Morrigan takes more damage. Oh dear, we can't do anything. Stabilizing. And you can't do anything. Victorious. Show them what you. Well, that's our meltdown counter going up by one. Confirm. Good to go. Missed the punch or physical weapon attack. Negative damage. Come on, people. There's that. But Fine. Mech destroyed. Ready and for well, one left. Heading out. Hmm. Might be able to take him out here. Engaging turn. Hell yeah. Not quite. Reporting critical hit. We are getting our first heavy mech as a result of this Let's mission, so I suppose at the end of the day, we have done well. And ho hey, We are not going to be cooling down, are we? What I can do is... Sh shutting down doesn't help us, though, does it? 
Watch my no, we can't blow up, I'm so damage. I'm just going to do nothing. On my way, double time. And yeah, we're good. Here you go, boom. No, he doesn't. I am out of short range missiles. Good to go. Well, we're Copy getting that. there, but it's pointless moving you now. Ready for orders. Yeah, go there. Acknowledged. Con let's hit him hard. It's not destroyed, but it's Report. no halved. Good to go. I wonder if you can steal another kill from way back downfield. Here we go. Can. Well, technically, you got an injection. Mission successful. So we lost the mech. We lost everything in it. I don't think there's going to be anything salvageable. Oh well, tough. We get it. I'm, I'm going to take the 70 ton catapult in pristine condition as well. With two TSEMP cannons, two ER medium lasers, and two LRM 20s, I think it is. If it was running. And we get 820,000. Look at that. Killed in action. We lost the pilots. You know what? I'm happy with that because she wasn't exactly an amazing pilot. And we had her on several mechs. I think <laughs> she was the cursed pilot. She lost the fire starter early on. And now she's lost the cougar. So in all fairness, having her die was probably the best thing ever. Ah, well... I mean, there is some of it left, so you never know. I don't think we lost anything else, though, so... Well, it's not so bad. There's four parts of the mobile PDS. And there's lots of AMS. AMS Mark II stack of three. Okay. I just want to go down here and see what is here. Is that vehicular DNI? We don't have anyone that can run DNI. That's the problem. But, yeah, we've got two catapults. This one's in pristine condition, therefore we cannot take it. Only the head is missing. AR-14. So, that's good. Yeah, it's in pristine condition. This one, we blew a side torso off. So, half of the mech is down. Ah, the XL engine's gone. But it has chameleon. But the chameleon probably, actually, might be built in. Missile, accurate weapon missile, which is just amazing. Or we take the Anzu, which comes with wrist fire control system, radical double heat sink kits. No, it doesn't because all that is blown to pieces. Eh, no. I think the catapult is the better option. It's annoying that I can't take the bigger, the, the, the intact version. What else was there? Star Slayer, Talon, and Thunderer. Well, the Thunderer is a 70 ton. That, that is the one that came with the arrow. Stealth Armor. Arrow, Stealth Armor. It's intact. Comes with an armored cow. Or just cow. So plus one injury resists. And plus five armor and structure in the head. We can't take that either. It's 19... Or well, it's 20 total. Fine. Let's take the broken catapult. We got the money to put together anyway. And I'm going to click disassemble all. Hopefully this doesn't disassemble. No. So I did have one mission where it did disassemble, I believe. Or maybe possibly I was thinking it wrong. Yeah, I'm going to take the AMS. AMS Mark II is a good... The arrow. I don't think they're good enough anymore. I just don't. It would be bogus to have a... Surviving part of such a volatile mech left. With so much ammo going, the only yeah, there would only be dust left. It, you're pretty much correct. So if it survives, I will be impressed. There's no Ah, there you go. Both TSE and P cannons. Oh, it's doing a weird thing with the text. Did they did one survive? One survived. The other one was in the torso. Hmm, I might want it, but then I've only got three bits. 
Engine. You know what? I'm tempted to take the next L engine just because we need one anyway. And we can sell that one. And that covers some of the costs. Fire control system AMS. I do like my AMS boats. And I've never seen that. So AMS has a minus 15% jam to chance per activation. Minus 10% heat per activation in AMS mode. AMS deals plus one damage to missiles. Minus 25% chance to two be shot down by AMS. Minus 25% chance to be shot down by AMS. Ah, so you've, you're literally... You've got less chance of jamming. Because it says so. Fire control system reduces jam chance, heat output, and increases damage of anti-missile systems, but reduces AMS hit chance. So yeah, you are getting a minus 25% chance to actually hit something. But you're doing more damage to whatever you do hit. Less heat and less heat, uh, jam chance. Maybe it's not that good. Defensive gyro, almost worth it. Double one would be better. There's a lot of stuff that we actually left on the battlefield. I'm thinking maybe five bins of caseless ammo is good. Or four bins of LK ammo. We are building a catapult. That would be helpful, I think. Shuttle for fire control AMS is powerful, but weighs two tons. It, yes, I did notice it also weighs two tons. There's a thermal exchanger as well. Brilliant item, in all fairness. Absolutely brilliant. But I think the LK and the AMS Mark IIs are very helpful at the moment. So we're going to go for that. How many AMSs can you put one? Hmm. Maybe you're getting one of those AMSs. We have our first mech. It came at the cost of a pilot. And I'm pretty sure there's gonna we're gonna we haven't seen it on the loot table or the the finished collect, um, collected loot, which means we're getting it back. But there's not gonna be much left of it. Maybe the last one means the chance of your own missiles be shot down. No, it's um, for that whatever you put that in to have less chance of actually doing its job. So if you were to put that in an AMS boat that had, say, six AMSs, like the tank, you're firing so much anyway, the minus 25% isn't probably too the bad, I suppose. Uh, Mech needs repairs. 300,000. We're going to get some of that back in a second because, yes, we do actually... Oh, never mind. Yeah, she's dead. There's an extra bet bunk if anyone wants to become a mech warrior. Quite possibly the cursed bunk. Uh, where is it? The Cougar. 40 tons. So we swap a 40 tonner for a 70 tonner. And let's see what we actually lose out of it. When the game stops lagging. Okay, saving. It's grinding to a halt. This is the way the game crashes after we've completed the mission. And I don't have an excuse to redo the mission and not lose the Cougar, the Ashwang. No? It's just... Sometime next week, maybe? In all fairness... It does mean we're getting a mech for a mech, so I've still got 10 mechs, which I very much like. Yeah, so it costs us 300,000 in damage repair after the mission, and 258,000 was the Ashwang. So, yeah, not too bad. Oh, Jesus. Why are you stuttering? Uh, kill the pilot and crash the game. I know, that's it's, it's done... More than any other mech has ever done. So we keep three light right or ultra light rotary rifles. It is properly lagging. We lose a tag, okay. And uh, we keep gunning A and B, so in all fairness. Okay, not too bad. We do lose the ability to have the AR20 warfare suite, but I don't actually think it's as good as an AR14. 
which I think we're getting from the thing. Right, I'm just going to come out of this because it's not liking this mech. There's too much damage for the game to process. So, goodbye. It gets me 400,000. That's going to go very much nicely into this catapult. So, yeah, AR-14 on the catapult. Um, Chameleon is built in. Endo steel is good. We just need all the engine stuff. Fine. I'm going to drop that. Why did you put ammo in the there? Meh. Right, we're going to drop that and that. Drop that down there. We're going to build this straight away, I think. We're going to uh, max the armor. Ah, it's on that weird thing where everything, you got two here, one here, and one over here. So you can't have a symmetrical build, people. Mm, right, so... Accurate weapons and missiles, so plus one accuracy, plus point one clustering chance with missiles. And then you've got plus long plus one long range accuracy, plus two extreme range accuracy, plus one accuracy, and minus one recoil for missiles. I don't think missiles get much recoil, do they? And then 140 affinity. We may never get to that, in all fairness. May never. So it wants a round of 250. I don't know if I'm going to run LRF, but I will leave that one in there for the moment. It's definitely going to have to run a... I'm going to put the XL one in there, partly because it's cheaper, for no other reason, if I'm honest. And I don't think I'm going to need a clan one. I will put a clan... Heat sink it in here, although the pirate one might come in handy. So, gunnery A. Heat bank isn't needed at the moment, but we have the option for it. Uh, none of that is actually going to work. Um, we'll come back to that. Gunnery B. Cockpit interface. Can't fit. We need the cockpit interface. Torso mounted one now. Okay, we need something more than an armoured cowl for the head. For the cockpit. Okay, nothing there. Angel ECM clan. Ooh. Angel ECM clan still weighs two tonnes. Guardian ECM still weighs one but this just does a lot more damage reduction ah, it's got the a14s i don't need that it's fine it's totally fine recoil tracking battle computer could be rather handy actually um so if i control mark two and tracking and critical battle computers I think that's a good start. Uh, upper recoil we probably won't need. Well, upper recoil would be good because it would give us plus one accuracy on three missile systems. But I don't think I want to do that. Stabilizer, minus 15% damage taken. Minus 20% stability damage taken with firing large weapons. We end up... No. No. No, because obviously Chameleon is staying in there. Right, let us see. We don't need anything there. Again, AMS Mark II might go in here. ATMs would almost be a good thing, but we don't have enough of them. So we've got two LRM 15. Let's check what ammo we have for LRM clan. We have three Artemis, one half bin. One regular, and that's it. Hmm. We only have one N20. He's only run standard stuff. Oh, I have no N20. 
Sorry, I have no regular 20s. Interesting. So do I go a... Weird thing like that. How many is that? 20, 30, 40, 55 missiles. That's annoying. It's l Yeah. Could uh, six SRM six? Sorry, four SRM sixes probably isn't enough. That'd be sixty, two hundred forty damage. Doing a hundred. It's about three hundred damage there, roughly. Minus whatever an LRM five drops, which is twenty five. So, two hundred seventy five damage. He is good. I don't think I need any lasers on this, if I'm honest. And the only way we can make this better is... So that's 10 tons, isn't it? Going 1N20? Actually, we could... No. So that's forty. I could check the store and see if there's another N launcher there quickly. I think I will. Thirty clan LRM and two bins of ammo. Uh, I still have the N twenty. I do. I'm going to see if there's any other N launchers in the store. Or anything worth buying at all, really. Flamers. We've got five of those. That's fine. Advanced optics. No. They're almost... They're not quite worth buying anymore. I know it's my... My cargo holds. Archer, Omni Fire Starter. No, 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 no. There is an MRM 20. And I have an MRM thing of some kind. Uh, what MRM did I have? 10. So that would give me 30. Hmm. Right, what we're going to do then is... I know roughly what build we're doing, putting in there. It's just what missile weapon systems we put in there. So... I'm going to drop all of that. I think... I, I do think two bins of dead fire probably not needed. Uh, we actually have an ultralight gyro in here. Which doesn't save us any weight. Or does it require the engine to show that? So XL. 250. It saves us two tons. But. And this is the big but. 20% more stability damage taken. So we get knocked over quicker. So I think we take that out. We could put the XL gyro in here. Saving us a ton and a half. I don't think we're too bad on space, if I'm honest. Uh, we weren't too bad on heat. Don't need any of that, no. We want the Mark II. We want gunnery. And gunnery. And... Yeah, we don't need any of that. Or that. Now, Artemis could be something that we've put, put in here. But I need to know what we're... 
um, using first. Ah, we do have the issue of having to put that there and that there. I don't care for jump jets. Uh, we want a clan heatsink, just in case we do need to put any heatsinks in there. It can be the smaller variety. Um, we have one proto, so I think we're good. Don't care for any of that. Endo steel. Or do we put that in? Yeah, it's one and a half tons different. So you know what? You know what? I'm going to take that out. And should we need additional tonnage? We've got those options, or we can see if we can get a defensive one, which I think I prefer. So we're going to leave it like that. Still 2.3 million and 17 days. We're going to get some more missions in, and then we're going to see what we have at that point. So I can try and get some more. Uh, not one more N LRM20 would be good. Oh. Or some maybe oh, maybe so we get some more clan missiles. That would be pretty good as well. So. I don't think we can build anything. Look, we have we have two 80-ton things. A cudgel and a Zeus X. Then we have all of that. Then we have all of that. And yeah, otherwise. Otherwise we're good. Right, so let's go forth. Five days, and we will have everything ready. I think less than that, and we'll have the upgrades for the ship. No. No, we're good. Right. So let's go find another fight. Yeah, I would love to have just put the build there and forget about it. Come back to it and be surprised when I remember there's a build in there. But ultimately, I think we've got some missing equipment to make it really worthwhile. Uh, what do we go for now? I actually think we go down a notch for a couple of missions to make it a little bit less stressful. Mm, or we just grind a bit more experience with people. So, here is our lance. Minus one. Who was meant to be in there again? I don't know. I think... I'm going to bring you back. Oh, no. We can only bring six units. So, tank people out of the way. You know, one thing we did lose, we lost the ping. We lost the ping, so we've got no one that can ping anymore. No error effect ping and no sensor lock of any kind. Well, uh, that is something we're going to have to look for. Right, hopefully that's our only casualty for a long while. But I too tend to find that when I lose a mech, I gain a mech in replacement. It's just whether that replacement mech is good enough. Ah, it's all good though. And we still get three of the ultra lights for another build, so it's not too bad, I suppose. Right, so this is going to take a moment to load up. Because there's a lot going in to the mission. Actually, technically, there's only three lances being deployed. Unless there's a blockading one, but there's very rarely a blockading one. Unless they've changed it, maybe later on it will be a common thing. I mean, ambush convoys aren't as easy as they once were. So you have to be able to take on three lances now. Three 
three individual lancers anyway. I think once we get the catapult up and running, doing some of the four and five skull missions is going to be a lot more manageable because we got a lot more missiles on the battlefield. Maybe, just maybe, along the way we'll get a few more heavy mechs. Also, won't let me bring this. There we go. Mission back up. Loading stream back up for me. We are three scar we're doing a three scar mission, so there probably won't be any heavy mechs. But maybe there'll be a Irby with an N LRM launcher. Who knows? So, an Irby with an LRM launcher or some clan stuff. But we are fighting local government. So, that, well, there is actually a chance, if I remember correctly. Somewhat of a large chance because there could be some clan tech on the battlefield. Either way, it's missile stuff that we want from this mission. It's taken a while to load everything tonight. I don't like it. Doesn't bode well. Even the duel at the beginning of the stream was a long load. Online. Weapons online. Yay. Right, give me some missiles. Command interface initiated. Right. Um, that's not what we... What map is this? 
Where are we going afterwards? Not down there, surely. We ain't going anywhere else, I guess. So moving out. Let's uh get moving. I Ooh, someone's got night vision. Oh yeah, Thunderbolt 10. It's gonna come in handy. Move into position. You've got night vision as well. And you, because you went green briefly. Confirmed. You don't have night vision. Uh, you have some brace. Confirmed. Yeah, I've, snu Holding. I've snuck some battle armor into the fights. Ten four. There's only meant to be six units, but Open I've up. got a seventh one. Got it. Position confirmed. Uh, yeah, brace you. Right, let's actually. I wonder if that is counting as in. No, it is not. Affirmative. That isn't either. Heading out. Roger. Neither is that. Wow, how close do we have to get? Move on out. Closer than that still. Wow. Roger that. Digging in. On the move. So that counts as being in. And that will. Ambush! So what am I seeing? Uh, Cloudbuster Shillelagh. Oh no, Shillelagh rifles. Uh, Galant tank. LM10 Delta. That's a missile. That is a warrior. Excuse me. Hmm. And a Prowler with an ECM. With another LRM10. Meh. On it. Uh, looks like we have some allied uh, turrets. So that is helpful. On my way. Uh, these guys are. This, well, this map spawns them really far away. Got it. Right, so spawn protection is gone, but they've still got 12 evasion, so we've got to wait for them to go so we can actually hit them. Although you yes, might Commander. be able to do something. 52. Yeah. And... 19. 52 is not bad, so... And the lasers get in range of there. Acknowledged. Did a bit. Not much, but a bit. Yes, Commander. You know what? We are going to reserve everybody. Let them have a go, and then we'll be Waiting able to hit opening. them harder. So, Warrior. What are you doing? You're going for the turret with the bombs Get and the missing, I would say. Location confirmed. Do that. All right, I'll give him the whole nine Have some years. damage. Yes, Commander. The Iron Khan. Coordinates received. I'm not going to fire the Thunderbolts. I'll fire the rest. Affirmative. Taking some armor off everywhere at the moment, which is not the best, but hey. And we'll go with the greater hit chance. We'll save the tandem stuff for the other tanks once they've moved next round. Nick, destroy! And yeah, we'll reserve everyone else. Holding for the right opportunity. And then we'll fight whatever moves next. Oh. Systems holding. Good well, to go. luckily, we can kick your butt. 
Actually, I'm going to go side because I could stay in the mineral fields. Much better hit chance. Oh, yeah. But it has it's a 70 ton tank. Interesting. 1400 armor. It's a glant. They are pretty tough, in all fairness. So if we get a chance to take that, that might be worth taking. Uh, you were just going to brace. No point jumping you off now, especially when you're so far away from everything. Ready for orders. All right, who has gone? Just that tank. No, you've gone as well. You know what? I think we focus on this tank. Confirm. Because it is quite tough. And the turret seems to be taking that lead as well. Ooh, straight fire at me, you little sugar shit. Sniper turret. Uh, yeah, go Location there. Confirmed. We'll go Fermo. I don't think we'll need you. Not the Inferno stuff. You're fairly weak. Yes, Commander. And yeah, go there. Good hit chance. Melee oh, attack. Wow. Extra damage. Lovely. Galant down. Next destroyed. Receiving you. I would not be unhappy if I could get a Galant out of this. I'd not be unhappy if that was the best thing that there was to take from this. Firing full couple of I am unhappy that I just did nine damage only there. Receiving you. To be fair, you didn't move last turn. I don't see the point in dismounting you for Let's this fight and then remounting you in a second so I'm not going to uh, let's go tandem locking in all weapon system not quite not quite Score the critical hit standing by and can I well, I can get a line of sight it's good confirmed Awesome. Tango down. How's it going? And that's gonna be a charge. Yeah, I don't want to charge. Let's Confirm. just melt his armor, and I think we might Engaging do target. so. Near enough. I think I hit something good. Tyrants will follow up and hopefully get it. Not quite. Damn. Not far off. Ooh, I mean, there was some damage done, but I don't know if it was that shot or not. Okay, turrets don't get the finishing job. Fine, I will do it. Acknowledged. Target down. Ready for order. Right, so where are we going next? We are going all the way down there. Are you kidding me? Ah, walking time. Okay, full speed it is. Waiting for orders. Got it. Hmm, should have been on active. Let's turn that to active now, while I remember. Receiving you. Oh, and that should be on as well because we're at night. Roger. I don't think it would have made too much difference in getting them out of there quicker, so I suppose we didn't lose too much there. Receiving you. On it. Uh, go active there. Commander. Yeah, just hang on for dear life. Uh, 
hell? That was nice and quick. Well, this this map is big for this mission type, anyway. Roger that. Aye, aye. I also have a feeling oh, no, we're going to get spread out quite a lot in running down there. Managing heat. Order acknowledged. Yeah, we'll jump on the road with most of them, I'd say. On my way. Oh, Got get it. us there quicker. A lot quicker with you, geez. Beat the cake. Roger that. Venting heat and stabilizing. Coordinates Go received. There. Go there. Affirmative. Confirm. Now this is. Heading out. Slow. On it. But I am getting there. I don't know where the trigger point is, though. That's the problem. So I'm going to hang around this rock and we're all going to regroup, I'd say. Holding here. If that rock turned out to be the trigger point, that would have been quite annoying. It's just laggy as hell. Copy that. I'm guessing my computer is doing something in the background that I'm not aware of. Heading out. Maybe it's updating itself. No problem. Uh, yeah, you can brace. Yeah, to be fair, there's not many right. mechs that are too far behind now. On the move. I think we can start pushing in. Roger. On the move. Yeah, because everyone's going to be about here or in this area this turn. Moving to position. So you're probably going to be the one that's kind of out of position the most because you're kind of a close range fighter. Copy that. But let's get this started. Uh, Tires look like they were mine, and it is a defend base. It is. We have a Bushwhacker X2, a Shadow Cat, a Bulldog, and a Maxim CCV. Not a CCTV tank. The Bulldog comes with plasma rifle, streak SRM4s, a machine gun. You're an ultra clan and medium pulse laser build, so you're clan tech. And then that is a AC10 Midron, machine gun, medium pulse, LRM5 Zeus. All in all, not too bad. And uh, yeah, next time we probably will jump the battle armor off and see if they can do something. I'm here. Well, you turned out to be in around about the right place. I'm gonna go for you and actually go vigilance for next turn. All right. Yeah, some damage. Commander. Uh, you were firing. Not really. We'll wait. Everyone else can wait. Yeah, they're going to go hard on the buildings. Standing by. Can I... Can't see the shadow cat. No, not with you anyway. Annoyingly, I'll just they're most likely going to take out the a building. Not oh, wait, that's a separate building. They're just alpha strikes. Good to go. Ooh, fine. That was you. We're going to take you out now. We've infernos with Fermo. Oh, you're closer going down. Ah, getting the turrets, good. That's fine. Orders. Ooh, Shadow Cat in the butt. It's just there, so. Put some acid on him. And now. We connect him with a kick. That's a large building. I'll let them shoot the large building. 
Standing by. Well, that'll be able to take a bit of punishment. Hmm, I mean, you're unsteady, so... Let's go for you. Why is this not firing? Locking on target. Like I stressed, nice. Yes, Commander. And the Morrigan. Acknowledged. Might actually go after you, because I'm pretty sure we might be able to take you out. But then I've got other mechs that can still fire, so maybe we finish this guy off. I think that might be the better option, or at least affirmative. Get rid of some stuff at least. Like the pilot from his seat. That's a good thing to have done. Yes, boss. Uh, Kronos. Yeah, that might. Moving to position. Be you down, tandem. Nah, improved. We've Got already it. taken enough armor off. There's no point doing tandem damage on you. On One the other tank, target. probably it's worth it. Orders. Uh, dismount and I think jumping is in order confirm and flamering giving them everything I've got and missing that your, didn't your only attack but you're gonna stray fire turret stray fire standing by right I'm actually gonna go um, yeah, we're going to go after the Bulldog. It's the better target. Roger. I was going to say on the back of this guy, but I think we've got enough people do it doing that anyway. Receiving you. Actually. Is that charge? No, it's a kick. Go for the kick. Make you unsteady for everyone else. On it. Engage. Oh, yeah. Some engine crits. Critical hit. Hmm. Now we Something I can do. have to figure out how we don't completely break you. I guess hitting this side, which is a little bit fresher. No problem. Okay, that arm's not, but I think we're good. I'm gonna give them the big bubble. Good. Taking a critical hit. Yep. Mm. You got the thermo bolts. Yeah, because I think I'd be risking too much stray fire there. On me, that is. You know Roger what? That. That's probably worth going for. Target confirmed. SRMs are out. Receiving you. Yes, yeah, go from the front. Location confirmed. Oh, straight fire could be a thing. Knocking on target. There goes an arm. He's lost an LRM5. That's Reporting. not the worst thing to Critical lose. Hit. Waiting for orders. Uh, go there. On my way. Yeah, there could be a little bit of stray fire here, but never mind. Firing. Tank oh, down. Yeah. I think the on. bushwhacker is going to go down this round. It's just what's left of him. Waiting for orders. Copy that. And we're also going to get him hot. Uh, and panicked. Good. So, I mean, he fires. He doesn't do much. Oh, turrets, don't you do it. You're going to ruin my day, aren't you? Well, that turret's not a, a friendly turret, I don't think. I think it's uh, been paid off. I'm receiving you. Mm, I don't want to fire you. It's not worth it, so... Brace. Roger. Benton heat. Again, same with you. Probably should have just moved you behind the rock, actually. Yeah. Position confirmed. Let's not fire those. Taking the shot. 
bit more acid. In actual fact, acid is probably a really bad thing to be firing. Position confirmed. It's maybe too much. Firing all weapons. No. Ready for orders. Um, just that. Firing. Panicked, but not punched out yet. He wants his turret. Commander. Yes, I'm there. I don't know what's in there, but. Taking the shot. Is that a punch out? Let's get no. Both done. side torsos are now open. Ready for order. He's gonna go boom. So. Let's have fun with a thermo bolt. Roger that. I'm steady and panicked. I'm not out, but the turrets may get him. Engine destroyed. Yeah. Okay. Well. Mission successful. So nothing we truly wanted, but we shall see what there is. Nothing we needed for the catapult, should we say. Got some monies. And... Yeah, there's the bushwhacker. It is takeable. I think the centaur has gone. The AC-10 mine drop would have been nice to take. And... I think we have some AC-5 mine drones, but... No, there is a Galant 70-ton tank. Cloud Cloudbuster Shalili. The Bulldog. With plasma rifle. Interesting. So I can actually walk away with a Bulldog and a Galant from this. Or a Prowler. I don't think... Enhanced... FPE. I can't see what that is, annoyingly. Uh, Shadow Cat. What about you? What are you... We have an Ultra 10 clan. I mean, that's actually pretty good. I've got one already. I can start building a... Um, ballistic mech. Shilly rifles, they are not great. 8 tons, 50 damage. Well, fair, it's not too bad. Damage variation of 10, so it's around about an AC 10. C3 Master. Yeah, I think we're going for a C3 Master. Fire control ballistic range. Sensors identify, no. Do we take some bigger tanks? I how oh there is an AC10 Mydron. 12 tons, 75 damage over five shots. Uses a regular AC10 ammo, so you can put incendiary ammo in there. There's also the warrior, but I don't think we need a warrior if I'm honest. So do we take a tank and then the AC10? I think that might be our best thing. Or do we take the Shadow Cat? But in all fairness, I don't really want the Shadow Cat. I want the stuff out of it. Which there's enough of to warrant taking it in one go. If I take that, how much more do we get? I get the four chose choosable picks. So we could go with that. And half the Galant. Is it the Galanta I want? We have an A-Pod, AC-10, Mydron, Machine Gun, 1400 armor, main battle tank, I can't remember what that gives us, or the Bulldog, 60 ton tank with the Plasma Rifle. Not as much armor though. And that's that one's quirk is main battle tank as well. 
Or we go for the shillelagh rifles. No, no, I don't think that would be worth it. If only we could change the ammo in there, the Mydron would be really good. The A-Pod, what does that target? A-Pod's target mechs or... Is it um, B-Pod's target battle armor? I can't remember which way around it goes. Yeah, I don't want you. There's nothing left of you. I'm also tempted to drop that just to take a, a full tank. Yeah, because there's no point taking two because we don't get any random picks. That's the master unit is going to be very handy because we can start building a C3 network. Uh, there you go, a pod. Um, power armor and protomex, 100% accuracy. Okay, and does 60 damage. That's a half ton bolt on item. The LR5 Zeus's aren't too bad. Six damage per missile. 15% jam chance and 50% misfire chance when firing in hot loaded mode. Plasma rifle isn't bad. It's heavy though. The clan plasma cannons are just better. I kind of want a bigger tank. So I'm going to take the Galant. I'm going to drop the AC-10. Done. Yeah. This is where I find out the Galant has a C3 Master unit. I didn't need to take that. Now I've got to find the right mech to put the C3 Master unit in. I don't think it's the Catapult. Although, to be fair, it would benefit a lot from it. So, I'm actually thinking that we should go and try and find a planet with Clan Coyote or Clan Burrocon. That's EJ reminded me that they've got the best stuff. And they, they do. They have the most amazing stuff anywhere. We just have to find it. Find a planet with them on. That isn't all the way out in Clan territory. Let me back into the loading screen of the game game. We're back. Right. Still not loaded. That's weird. It's loading a lot of damage, apparently. I don't think we took that much damage, did we? No, four days. Four days. There's nothing. Yeah, three skull is a little bit too light for us, but I think four and five skull just has the potential to do too much to us. So I don't necessarily want this mech. Um, we are getting a little bit out of it, but let's just scrap it because it is really struggling, struggling, struggling for me to talk at the moment. But the game's struggling to load the mech bay after missions at the moment. Come on, game. Well, 
it's because it's saving it. It's taking a long time to save it. Or I'm just playing the game too quick. So what are we getting out of the Shadow Cat? The Ultra 10, obviously. Some ammo for it. A medium pulse is not too bad. And... Double heatsink clan is good. The mask is built in. The jump jets are built in. Interesting. And we also get another ferrofibrous. Awesome. That should be about half a million, I believe. And yeah, just over. Awesome. Good monies. Good monies indeed. Right, let's... Oops, no. Why did it... I wasn't touching anything on the keyboard. Why did it say I wanted to... Scrap everything? None of my keys are accidentally depressed. Oh, I just realised. The Galant. I need five parts of it, don't I? Because... My video series requires four. I'm going to get caught out with that every single time. Okay, it's not doing anything now. Maybe one of the keys was slightly depressed. I didn't realise. Maybe. Okay, right. So, no new tank, sadly. That is not a problem. Let's check the store for anything amazing. Shadowhawk? No, it's not amazing. Uh, advanced optics, still there. No, it's still there. The fire stars are still there. Myrmidon, tank, no. SRM carriers to lights. MRM 20, Street SRM 4. No, nothing's changed. Fine. So, navigation. Let's see if there is a... Pl I don't, there's no way to, ch uh, to f search by faction, annoyingly. Clan Diamond Shark, Ghost Bear. No, it's none of those. Clan Wolf. Hell's Horses. More Hell's Horses. Clan Wolf. Steiner. Oh, that's Jade Falcon, which is always a good shout for Death from Above stuff. Pirates are making a reappearance. Clan Diamond Shark. Are they closer? No. Doesn't appear. So. So what about just outside? That's the Channel Islands. There's some Clan Diamond Shark just there. Hell's Horses. Clans, all of the above. Okay, okay. I mean, that might be something. That's only a million sea bills. That's only 900,000. 900,000, 121 days. 127, that is 131. That's a tough planet. Clan Star Adder. Clan Coyote is way out there with Clan Star Adder. But yeah, Clan Coyote. And then there's Clan uh, Clan Co Cloud Cobra. And that is all of them. Clans. So which is the one we're looking for? Cobra, Jaguar, Nova Cat, Ice Hellion. It's that 
Night Glyph Scorpion. Fire Mandrill, that one. Barak. Clan Stone Lion. More clans. So I wonder if these planets. have all of the factions on it might be there is I don't know but in the inner sphere it doesn't look like there is unless there's one planet somewhere that has all of them but it doesn't appear like there is hmm I mean, if it made it too easy to get, then it would be giving away society stuff, I suppose. And I could be here for hours clicking on all of these, so I'm going to give up. And let us... Go forward a couple of days, get the pilots back and go in again. Hey boss. We've just completed those upgrades. I've got so it's engineering as well. I think third mech bay is getting close to being a good thing to have. Let's get a cheap one of these going. Or is that? That's yeah, not too cheap. Extra vehicle slot would not be a bad idea. getting more on the battlefield but at the moment I don't think we need to yeah, let's go for that one nice and cheap I'll get the crew moving. nice and cheap and one more day done right command center do we finish with Four and a half skull assassination. I think we do. Let's see if we can get that done. Go with the same lance. Yeah, I think the same lance is a good idea. Yeah, it's fine. Let's hope we get some nice stuff, some interesting stuff. And maybe, just maybe, we'll get another heavy mech. Could you imagine if we get the assault mech out of this one though? No, I don't know if I'd want to take on an assault mech, if I'm honest. What, not when I'm still running light mechs. Let's hope that it doesn't take too long to load.
Reactor online. Sensors online. Weapons online. All systems nominal. Only two things. So one lance in the target. That's not so bad. I don't think we're going to get a spawn near. No, nowhere near. So let's go for near the main, the, the lance. Oh, I didn't bring my tanks. Hmm. Okay, well, we're not fighting with tanks. Let's not. Oh, that's a lance of tanks down here. Hopefully, it's not a full thing. I oh, know that's. Sprinted with damage, and that is a quad mech falling over and losing a wound already. What the hell is an Aryan one? Yes, Commander. I have no idea. Affirmative. Well, there's a battle tank, a medium rifle carrier, and a thunderbolt. Nine SE. I'm gonna go with this as primitive, though. Yeah, that is a quad mech. It's tiny though. Four hundred eight total armor. Let's do this. Hmm. On my way. Tiny Double tank. Time. Ready for orders. And um, searchlight on. Active there. Confirmed. Let's brace it up. You're standing up. Or are you failing to stand up? No, you're standing up by the sounds of things. It looks odd. It is a f light 35 ton thing. It might even be a proto up, quad mech. That could be interesting. Position confirmed. Standing by. Uh, yeah, you're going to do nothing. Actually, Got no. It. Next turn you'll dismount. So, you, yeah, that's the right call, I think. Aye, aye. Confirmed. Standing by. And uh, no, it's going to move you. On the move. Active. Done. So far, none of this is. A, I mean, the Thunderbolt is not going to be a bad thing to take. Large pulse. So it is not a primitive. No, double heat sinks. But it is also. Got nothing amazing in there, but it's an upgrade. It's one, which is good. I'm here. That's not a bad hit chance. Order acknowledged. Let's see if we can drop you very quickly. Somewhat. Wow. Can't see what's in you, so that is a shame. Uh, yeah, go there. And fire. Roger. Clan double heat sink. Interesting. So you're a clan quad mech. There's the target doing something. Going? I almost don't want to blow you up, if I'm honest. But Copy let's that. finish you off. Actually, we didn't. We... He punched out. Tracks. That's not just any quad mech. That's a tracked quad mech. Yes, boss. Interesting. On my way. Uh, yeah. Medium rifle, not as good a hit chance. Now we're gonna go for Manticore. Firing at enemy six. Not too bad. Water. Six percent. You know what? We're gonna go for you. I put some acid on you. Everything I've got. Realize you're a carrier. You don't have what much do you armor, so let's utilize that. Ooh, I got the target in sights. It's a Crusader Creel Crayon Creal Cruel. 
I don't know. SM6 is machine guns and medium lasers. It is a brawler, but it is still a crusader with nothing spectacular in you. So we have two heavy mechs, neither of which are amazing. Uh, yeah, do extra damage to this guy. Get rid of him. Attacking from position. Try to get rid of him. Most of that was stray fire. Boosting lots of armor. Good for you. Right, we're gonna ready for orders. Dismount. We're a little bit out of position. I think if we jump this round, we're good Copy for that. next round. Sorry, all wet. Oh, so close to getting the little tank or carrier tank. It's actually not so little. I think it's a 60-ton tank. So, what should I go for? The Thunderbolts or the Crusader? I don't think I've had either of them, if I'm honest. Both 65-ton mechs. LRM-10 destroyed. So, you hot-loaded your LRM-10. Nice. Commando. Location yeah, finish this guy off. Copy that, Commander. Easy. Yes, Commander. And possibly finish this guy off. Move on out. He didn't move, so there's quite a good chance yeah. of doing so. Nearly. Waiting for orders. Very nearly. On my way. Firing. Gone. Right, so they're just the two remaining 65 tonners. Uh, I can get a line of sight from there. It's hmm. a reasonable hit chance, I suppose. Good to go. Alright, I'm going to use you. Uh, on the Thunderbolt, I guess. Standing by. And I'm gonna have you on it. Start pushing this guy. The crayon. Crusader. One of them didn't do anything. The Crusader didn't do anything. Move into position. Yeah, go all in. Except we're going to go thermo. He's unsteady. But he's going to move now. But he's a tad bit hot. And keeps his heat. Waiting for orders. Affirmative. Have some damage. Yep. Lifting off. Have a little bit more heat. Orders. On my way. Um, let's not. I copy. Destroy him. Let's just try and uh, keep him hot for the Good moment. I think you. Okay. Start moving this way. Receiving you. Yep, keep going. Down. Good to go. Majestic. I actually want him to go to see if he shuts down. Commander. Because I've got no other. Inferno. Yes, Commander. In this. No. He's not shut down, but he doesn't get too colder either. Location confirmed. Well, let's put some missiles. That. Ah, too much. Not well, not entirely too much. How's it going? Also, he doesn't have an XL engine, does he? So, ultimately. Let's do this. That wouldn't be the worst thing anyway. 
Plus, we can get around behind him. Turn that off so we don't do as much damage. Target lock on enemy six. Punch out? Not quite. I'm receiving you. Uh, something tells me you should start moving that way. Quick step in it. Rod. Primary target damage, Commander. I'm going to try to take both of these guys so that I have an option to take both of these guys. Basically. Hmm. Heat went down. Waiting for orders. I think that has something to do with using up heat sinks and in. in his turn it will represent a bit better. Locking in all weapon system. Commander. Yeah, you're going to be you're going to explode if I take, fire you. So, reserve you. Receiving you. Heading out. I mean, it might explode, but... Roger. Add some heat. Yes, Commander. Did we... We didn't open him up. No. But I could kick with nothing, actually. Or just some of that. Moving out. We missed the kick. No. Pilot ejection. That was perfect amount of firepower then. The kick, missing the kick was perfectly expected and planned. Totally. Ready for orders. Uh, taking this guy on with little guys might not have been the best idea, actually. Just remembered it would have been a bad idea. Okay. Rattle up. We're gonna get him though. Yeah. You didn't do anything. Copy that. You fired about three times. Well done, you. Heading out. Firing. Standing by. Copy that, Commander. And missile. Ready for order. And a kick. Let's see. Yeah, let's go for it. Targeting for physical attack. We got him unsteady. I don't think we really have any follow up on that, unfortunately. But. No, because he gets to go now. Oh! Omri Gyro destroyed. Luckily, that doesn't make much difference to us. Move order received. Confirm. Well, have some heat. Oh no, I knocked my guy over. No, don't blow up, don't blow up. I'm wounded. Yes, boss. I'm wounded myself, basically. Ah, shh. Waiting for order. Yeah. He gets to know he's gone this round. Good. The target is retreating, Commander. Eliminate it before it escapes. Can I get a direct line of sight? I can. Got it. I'm not going to fire those. I don't want to hit my guy. My mech. Copy that, Commander. I don't think I did. Right, he shouldn't be able to get to his target location. He's also getting staying hot. No, he will not get there. Wow. Standing by. Ready for orders. Do I go for? Well, that's a punch. I don't want to. Punch, I want a kick, so let's go for a kick. We kick him. And smash him. And receiving you. Copy that. Let's see, we hit him there with he's stressed, his leg is open. It's good to go. Ooh. 
We'll go with the missiles. Engaging. Just the missiles. SRM crit. Reporting. Major armor loss. And a bit of straight fire, apparently. Orders. Affirmative. Commander. No, we're not going to activate you unless we have to. Commander. Thermo bolts. And the Ultra 2s are probably worth firing. Bit of splash damage. Never mind. That is a knockdown on the Crusader, though. He also has very little armor left. Yeah, I think we're not going to get this, are we? We're not going to get the option of a full Crusader, I don't think. But we have a Thunderbolt. All right. Back in the fight. Ah, oh, we've lost an SRM-2. Have we? Yeah, it's gone from the center torso. No. Oh, well. Let's not fire those. Acknowledge. Punch out. Awesome. So, Mission successful. two full mechs to choose from. Can only take one, though. And the weird quad tank. Hmm, not sure what the quad tank is all about, but we'll find out, I guess. Money. Uh, yeah, we have some damage on the Owens. We'll put that back together. So the Aryan. Protected actuators, quad V. Okay, so quad Vs can convert to vehicle modes, which greatly reduces stability damage. Quad Vs have a 360, 360 degree firing arc. Uh, vehicle mode, they have 20% stability threshold, 20% maximum stability threshold. Oh, sorry. Sorry, 20% maximum stability and minus 99% stability damage taken. They have plus one accuracy and minus one recoil. Uh, modifier scatters, so 20% minimum and minus 30% maximum for artillery. Quad V Mix kicks to 100% more damage and 50% more stability damage. I mean wasn't so small I'd take it it's not a I mean it's not completely blown up but it's only 35 tons also I can only take the Thunderbolt I can't take the Crusader full Thunderbolt isn't exactly bad it's got multi-track it's everything standard in this guy apart from the double heatsink large pulse laser uh, we blew up some of the heat sinks. Otherwise, it's a mech that'll be quick to put to the battlefield. And there is very little else worth taking. I kind of wish I could take you as well somehow, but there's no way of doing so. Fine, we... Ooh, what weapons did you have? SRM6s. SRM6s in the leg. Okay. Oh, melee punch, upper spiked. Okay, so you're, you're spiked armor as well. A charging spiked mech would not be a bad thing. Let's just disassemble you. And we've got two claws, which is always extra damage for punching. Lower melee punch. Having a pair of those is always good. Let's take those. Upper spiked means we do 
So, minus 5% punch attack, physical weapon attack, minus 5% charge attack damage received, uh, plus 10% charge attack damage, plus 15% charge attack stability damage and minus 10% and minus 15% self damage and stability damage on a charge actually want the spiked armor because that means we minus 10% walk distance minus 20% charge attack self damage plus 20% okay we're gonna go for the charge mech I don't know what's gonna run it but we're gonna go for charge builds a charger maybe I don't know, but we're going to go for a charging mech at some point, somehow, some way. Maybe it's the... No, it won't be the Thunderbolt. I mean, it could start off as the Thunderbolt and we go from there. But we have another mech to build, another heavy mech to build. What mech do I get rid of, though? Because I don't want to have more than 10 mechs at the moment, I suppose. There it is. Not too bad on repairs. But yeah, we did lose an SRM too. I don't know if I'll be able to replace it. We'll just have to wait and see. Um, Mech Bay. Let's see, let's see, let's see. So, a lot of cooling. We kind of needed it. We'll get rid of that. Give it a that. It'll make it colder. Okay, so... We've got no ballistic. It's all energy. Medium diverse optics. Four of those. That works. Medium exostars. I think micro lasers suit this mech. Medium pulse clap. That's very close range. Four medium improved heavy lasers. That is also very close range. With 40 damage. Hmm. No, I don't think that's going to work. I kind of want. Diverse optics are for 20 range. The Art Large Clan is 540. That probably is better. So let's go with... ER Clan. ER Medium Clan. Drop that down there. I'm thinking... SRMs. Do we have SRM6s? Now we don't have an SRM2 for our other mech. They are 360, so a little bit less. Ooh, we still need a little bit more cooling. And we need ammo. Which we'll get. And you know what? I think an AMS Mark II is worth putting in this guy. So, ammo, AMS ammo, SRM, Inferno, LK. I would love to put acid in here as well, but I don't think we totally need it. That's that. So, cooling. we got the double heatsink kits, so let's put a regular double. We've got... You know what, do I even need an XL engine in this guy? Or can I get away with putting a gyro stabilizer in here? 
endo clan. I might might just do it. I might have to go to clan double heat sinks in all fairness. Although I do have a heat bank. That probably is worthwhile. I don't think I have any bolt on stuff. No. We got gunnery A, that's probably worthwhile. We've got jump jets. Let's do that. Uh, what's that one? My 10% jam chance. I think the Mark II is better, although I can't remember whether I put that in the. I must have. I'm pretty sure I did. Put it in the upper mech. Catapult. So this is where I think we might need to go. Instead of endo steel. Might need to go. Actually, fact, we don't need that because... I'm not putting any battle computers in there. We've got multi triangle ready, so maybe just fire control improve for plus one gunnery and night vision. And sensor tracker. We're not too bad on armor, and we're not too bad on heat. So how much put wood in a clan engine B? It fits, we get six tons and we wouldn't have enough room for heat sink, so I'd have to switch to clan heat sink. I actually think maybe we got two of these, so maybe um we need one additional slot, I think. Oh no, wait, it's because we have a jump jet in there. So we need to take that out. Put that in there. Put that there. And we gain one and a half extra tons, which is going to be brilliant for maxing the armor there. And finding somewhere for a double heatsink to go. The other arm was still cold by two. Okay, I think we can manage two. So yes, putting an exile engine would give us a little bit more room, but I think this gives us more survivability. All liner, there's no room for that. Just clan armor, given this case, is worthwhile. Let's try and see if something go boom then. We'll leave the jump jet in there. What's wrong? Is that just from it being broken? Yes. So putting clan armor in there doesn't really cost too much more. It's 28 days. But I think we're good. Uh, I would like to make it colder. But also... How much do these weigh? One ton each. Yeah, taking those out doesn't really help us. It'd give us four tons. Not really enough room to do anything with. I'm gonna max the armor a little and have about three tons left. Not even that, maybe three and a half.
Yeah, I think that'll do. That will do. On it. I'll let you know when that's done. So which mech do we get rid of? Yeah, it always wants to be this guy, but no, I think it might actually be the Phantom. So it's only running machine guns, and therefore its only purpose really is battle armor proto mech hunting and headshot hunting. But that's random headshot hunting, nothing else. So. I'm going to sell you. I don't think anyone's really got any affinity for you, so that's fine. So you have a new mech. Let us... Well, it'll be next time round that we get to it. Next stream. But we have got time for one more mission tonight. I am just thinking, do we jump plan to see if we can find some better pilots? What is close by for that. us? This planet, which is being raided once again. Have we have been there, yes, we have. No, we haven't been there. We can't have been there. No, because that is a three skull orange. That's one skull orange. That's far too light for us. What planet are we on? Four skull. That's three and a half, 21 days away. That's four skull, 26 days away. That's a clan owned planet. I don't want that. 21 days away. I mean, I would like to stay here, admittedly. But I'm thinking we go for some new pilots. So let's travel. By your command. Once I've got a, ha uh, a handful of got a new really good pilots, then I won't be too worried. So we haven't even been paying everyone full. And in all fairness, I think we can get away with paying people minimum wages at the moment because only two mechs are really needing work. And those are, well, one's going to be ready. The catapult's going to be ready, but I haven't got a build. And obviously, the, uh, the Thunderbolt's in a little bit off. Fine. I didn't actually check the store before we left. I can't do it now. There's going to be something amazing here, isn't there? There's an end. Screw you, game. You know what? No, we're going to... We're going to... Leave it. Angarona. Battle armors. Camouflage system. I probably shouldn't. Missile bay, weapon bay, weapon mount recoil. No, let's let's just go. It's it's new pilots we're really after, and the equipment we will eventually find. Uh, Grandshaw leave gets athletic and one injury. Uh, well, better than nothing, I suppose. Ah, one thing we need to take a look at is you need to find another thing to go in your SRM2 slot. Tendon rockets. It's almost worth it. Almost. 
In all fairness, the extra ton. I might just use the armor up. Need to repair the gyro. One thing we can do is give this <laughs> four tons, yeah. Medium improved, one ton, two slots. Give me one of that. That. Wish I could kind of put something else up there. In all fairness, you might be the next mech we drop. Because you are kind of still useful to get around behind mechs. Yeah, third in fairness, we're only going in ten, which is we're still losing ten damage. No, we're losing we're losing a lot of damage. You know what? I'm actually gonna drop you. Yeah. Let's do so. Simply because it's time to get rid of it. And I think it's worthwhile because we've got some heavy mechs coming. We're going to get more heavy mechs and we're going to need to get rid of mechs anyway. And we can also just put mechs, some of the spare mechs in to make up for the fact I've just dropped you from the main lance. Might as well check the hiring halls along, the, along the way. Because there's always a chance that we find something amazing. Not this time, though. Right, let's go for faster movement between planets. Right, I'll get the team on it right away. So I think that's probably a worthwhile one to go for. Uh, for our garden party! Yay! We get 10 morale. And three medical points, which doesn't really help us apart from getting Sumo back a few days quicker. Looks like we've arrived, Commander. Oh. Oh, did we already? We already looked at this planet, so we got no one. <laughs> Punisher, is useless. Yeah, none of these pilots are any good. A uh, good decision on getting rid of the mech was that. It's always a good thing to clean out. Yeah, nothing there. Machine gun incendiary ammo is worth picking up, I suppose. New equipment available. Right, give me an avatar. A more expensive avatar. I don't like avatars though, and I can't afford it anyway. AMS. Compact engine. Interesting. Some swords, a weapon mount recoil. I have three of those. I'll buy that so I've got two pairs. New equipment available. No N N L R Ms, sadly. Oh well. Right, well. Let's give everyone some experience, then go do one more fight, I'd say. I'm here. Alpha Wolf. I don't actually know what to give you. I'm thinking. Tactics, you know what? Let's push straight up for sense lock, and that's it because that is one thing you Next probably will be good for. Complete. Standing by, striker wants more movement in the training tank. Confirmed, Commander. Standing by, Hunter and the Kit Fox. Training for that, complete. Jelly Roll hasn't got a mech at the moment. One taco coming right up. <laughs> But we can give you more Mech gunnery at least. Complete. Yes, Commander. Hmm, in a Morrigan. We do need sensor lock, and we need someone that run can use it. But at the same time, you're more suited for Warlord, I think. 
Training confirmed, Commander. Orders. Pathfinder Fujin. No, it's gone. Hunter. It's not kind of used. I... Give you gunnery. Training complete. Confirm. Raza has been in the Scorpion. I will do something with the Scorpion eventually. Owens can be useful on Solaris. Hmm. I have some mechs that would probably be pretty good there as well. Receiving you. So. Mech warrior and I'm and I don't have any intentions to go to Solaris just yet. So. I think we're okay there, but yes. Having a mech... <laughs> Toga, you've got no mech anymore. Speaking of the de um, bad things. Uh, speaking Training of the Owens. He will get a new mech. We've got other light mechs that he can jump into anyway, That's so it's okay. not such a bad thing. Vor. Kronos. Let's give you Warlord. Training complete. Last but not least. I'm here. I actually think sent. You're already pretty good at shooting with your squad. So I'm thinking sense lock with you is actually worthwhile. Because it means it doesn't just help you, it helps everybody else. And we're always going to have that in the lance as long as we have it. So let's go do a fight and see what goes on. Blackout or an urgent matter. Okay, we're not doing um, escorts because it's three separate lines. So I don't want to fight that. Uh, Razor of Decimated Ghost Bear Company. Uh, they've hired a well regarded mercenary outfit to engage the planetary government operations on the planets. Ah, okay. Ghost Bear. Mm, no. We'll keep working for Kurita. I don't want to do an attack and defense. No. We're going to go for a blackout in the Badlands. Not desert. Badlands. That's what it is. Right, so we're going to take six mechs, which is this six. Oh yeah, the catapult is ready to go, but not ready to go at the same time. You're going to bring the scorpion and Raza. Let's get you in there. Yeah, okay. And these little ones are terrible. I think these guys are actually better. Maybe. We'll deploy those anyway. Yeah, we can't take any mechs. We can only, well, tanks, sorry. We can only take these. Fine. And we didn't have a warning on our lance droppage. So that's good. See, I do like the Morrigans at 35 tons because it's got the laser cutting ability. And again, that probably needs a little bit of love as well. I will admit, it probably needs a little bit of love and to synchronize its weapons a little bit more. Because we probably can do that now. So that is probably something that we need to do next time. Yeah, because having all of the mechs working a bit more streamlined now 
is going to be very, very handy. And we need to put the catapult onto the battlefield, even if the build is not perfect. I think it just needs to go and we'll work it, work it out as we go. That way we can more easily, more easily, more efficiently do these missions. The like three to, well, four to five skull missions. Whilst we look for all the equipment and other heavy mechs. Because I am finding a lot of different heavy mechs in this playthrough. Maybe, just maybe, we will get there. Also, does anyone know how to get to the Quartermaster's stores? Because every faction has two Quartermaster stores, but they're never owned by... On, on planets that they're owned by the faction. Was Solara, or sorry, was Steiner one that we did last time? And was that the exception? I can't remember. No, I think that was down the bottom in Liran and Darien space. But yeah, is this, is, are both of those parts of the online map? I'm guessing they might be. Right. Let's see how much Weapons we face online. and what we face. All systems nominal. So wait, four skulls. There's possibly going to be heavy mechs. Command interface. We might initiated. fight just turrets though. That's the thing. Now yeah, we're back to a on my way. Well known. Map, come on, load in and let me move. Game. Move order received. Affirmative. Yeah, bit of a conga line going. Oh, yes, and then the quad mech. Ah, you've got ping, so that's a reason to keep you in the lance all the time. Holding and cooling. I don't think going that far ahead with you is worth it just yet. Because I don't think anyone can Copy that, Commander. keep up with you. Moving to position. Kickfox will be able to trigger it with you next turn. Roger that, Commander. Yeah, I need I think I need PPCs on the Scorpion. I think. Move order received. I'm there. What do we get? A surprise ambush. But it's not a surprise because I knew it was coming. And we get turrets, friendly turrets. We got another Thunderbolts. We got a Tempest, a Valkyrie 2, and a Wolverine Quick Cell. Okay, let's send you over here. 
I'm actually going to send you there so we can try and get Roger this guy that. in the bus. Uh, yeah, send you over here. Heading out. And send you there, I you guess. No, we'll keep you on for the moment. I don't really know what to do with the battle armor half the time. I'm receiving you. Tempest looks fairly big. About the same time as the size of a thunderbolt. Sorry, that's the thunderbolt. Oh no, wait. Va um, Valkyrie. Okay, they're all looking like heavy mechs. Wolverine's definitely not though. You know what? We're going to wait for them to go. And wait for them to go again. Hopefully they go for the turret, but you never know. Thumper turret! That's not good for us. Yes, Commander. Yeah, you're gonna wait. Commando? Hmm. Yeah, let's hit this Thunderbolts. Five S S is nothing spectacular. It's a fairly standard build. What? Yeah, I don't know what each of those are, if I'm honest. Right. Gauss rifle. Interesting. Do they think they can hurt me? That's what you're running. And yeah. Reserving action. Let's let this guy go, and then we'll be able to hit him in the butts. Long tom artillery. You put it on yourself. Okay, right. Aye, aye. But if... He can't fire if he's not there. So what we're going to do is we're going to... Dismount. Can we mount up? We can. In the same turn? Engaging. Well, it's a physical attack. It's not a, like, swarm attack. I mean, that's not bad. Good. Did quite a lot of damage to the leg. Hey, yo. And yeah, go there. And fire. Here we go. Not too bad. Receiving you. This should finish it off. Moving to position. Uh, we're actually going to go active with that. Whilst I remember. Alpha strike. Boom. Thunderbolt twenty. You. Ah, you had a quick sell. Thing. And you're running a Thunderbolt 15 as well. Yeah, you're running a Quicksell Long Tom or something stupid like that. Moving out. Uh, I think we might be too close for that. So let's not fire it. We'll fire the rest though. Locked on target. Get you hotter. Get you easier to see in heat in heat vision. And searchlight affected. Well, it's not on at the moment. It is now. Attacking from position. 
Not bad damage. Put him on steady as well, making it easy for everyone to hit. And... Yeah, go behind you. Gauss rifle, medium, lasers, large pulse, SRM-6. 65 ton heavy. Tempest. Got the angle. Taking the shot. Not quite taken out, but not bad. Ooh, that guy got in hit in the face. So Thumper Artillery can fire directly. I'm gonna have to get a hold of one of these to actually work out whether they're worth yes, Commander. playing or not. Because I, I clearly don't know. Let's right, go there. Roger. Kaboom! Something that went kill. big and boom in there. Yes, Commander. And can you? You're not going to be able to jump on the mech that you Here come off go. of. Not just yet, anyway. Got it. Have some more damage. Bit of splash damage as well. I don't know if they do splash damage. Receiving you. All right, this guy isn't looking too fresh, so we're going to start hitting on the thunderbolts. Who's also just been hit in the face, Commander? That's not too bad. Hitting out. Firing on rear arc. Are you getting hot? That's fine. Ready to rock. Scorpion. Yeah, we'll I go there. Full speed, no target. Have some jamming. How's it going? I don't think on I'll it. stray fire myself. Hopefully not anyway. Hiring full complement on enemy. Unsteady, yes. Uh, we took out a building. Yay. So both of these guys are Um panicked. Armor smelting off. Oh, stressed, sorry, but they're both headshot. You're shutting down. Why couldn't you do orders. that earlier? Can I get you in the head? Affirmative. Well, we're going to try. Uh, let's not fire those. We don't need those. Locked on. If he's shut down, I don't think he's going to survive the turrets. Ooh. There goes the arm. Ooh, ER large laser blaze fire. Gone. Damn it, splash damage. What's that from? That's because we've got two thumper turrets. Waiting for orders. That would be what's doing it. Right, let's get this guy in the face, hopefully. Come on, people. Let's nah, we got the side torso. No, I think we pilot lethal damage. We got the face. And we got the face a lot. That's good. Confirm. And Roger that. Have some of that. A punch out from you would be amazing. I don't think we did enough damage there to really do it. What are your orders, Skipper? I think I'm just going to move you because you're rather toasty. Roger. Firing. Yeah, who goes half of you? Take that. Yeah, I'd imagine we're going to blow you to pieces. It's 
So we might as well just do that. Not yet. He gets to go, sadly. Uh, his PPC is crit. Interesting. Okay, he punches out. That's fine. Waiting for order. Uh, right, you can decide in that way. Commander, I'm wounded. Why? Yes, boss. Why, game? Why? Location confirmed. Uh, active on Guardian. Right, so. Let's go there. Got I'm not going to sprint everyone crazy because right. I need to go pick up my battle armor. Coordinates received. Location confirmed. Position confirmed. There's Got that. that and. Mount up. Move into position. Done. Right, now we can start heading off properly. Although, we pretty much are there. Confirmed. Leaving the little kit fox behind. Leaving That's some of my, my other mechs behind as well. Affirmative. Aye, aye. All right, you're definitely going to do nothing. Excellent. My mech could use a rest. Coordinates received. Roger. Oh, the lag. On my way. Moving to position. Go I'm there. Aware. And you're bracing. Copy that. And not just yet. Not just right. yet. Cooling off for a while. Right now we Got can it. go in and trigger it. What do we get? An ambush? Yes. Sorry, you're late. It's fine. We just trap you in some battle armor and make you walk all the way to the front line of the battle. As punishment. Um, no, you're fine. It's all good. How are you, Captain, anyway? What the hell is... That's a lamb. Can't see it, but that is a wacky on. That's a pit bull. That's a sheriff. That's a ISV. Light AC-5. It's not bad. 50-ton tank. And that is a Centurion. Light Gauss rifle. m 15 And ER medium. Probably running a XL engine, but that is a lamb, people. Hmm. Mech warriors, show them what you uh, They have a C three network, apparently. Standing by. Uh, we are going to have to let them move first, really. Yeah. So reserve. Waiting for the right play. Reserve. Holding for tactical advantage. Uh, are these tar they're nothing just yet? I am glad that you're doing good. It's always yeah. better when everyone is happy or at least good. Acknowledged. Hmm. We have a lot of initiative. A lot of initiative. It's, it's Roger, annoying that I've got this much initiative and I cannot hit them. Roger. In fact, it might have been worth just moving so we don't get the, the initiative penalty next turn for hesitation. But I think we will be fine one way or another. Skipper. Oh, can you... Yeah, you can get around behind. Double time, let's go. What? How big are you? Interesting. 
We are toasty. So let's not fire that. Affirmative. Ooh, LRM15 already crit. Good. Ha, you like that? Yes, Commander. Yeah, you're gonna reserve. That lamb looks interesting. It's going now. No. Reporting minimal friendly battle neck down. Are you kidding me? Majestic's dead. We've lost two pilots tonight. Waiting for orders. Wow. Acknowledged. Uh, well, we're going to try and get hold of this guy. Come on, people. Let's make it happen. Still flam destroyed. Sorry, the Double is. XL lamb clan engine. What? Standing by. Okay, maybe losing the Morrigan might not be the worst thing in the world then. Moving to position. We're gonna get this guy on the ground and see what happens. Let's not fire those. Engaging. Got him in the face. Don't blow up, don't blow up. Two of six. You're not bleeding out, annoyingly. I'm here. I copy. Streaks to the face. I mean, you have very little armor, but hopefully you get some shots to the face. Locking on target. Nah, side torso's open. Reporting. Critical hit. So we're gonna blow him up somehow, because that's just what we do. You know what? I'm gonna go down range with an alpha strike. Locked on target. We'll cause some problems and get you in the face. I don't want to get you in the face. Or out. Right, sheriff and then the pit bull are going. That is a big looking lamb. It might not be as big as it actually is because it's got no turret. The double XL engine's gone. It might not. Wait, it is gone. Let's just face it, it is gone. If it isn't gone, I'll be surprised. Um. Orders. Let's dismount you. I have a feeling you might. Oh, why can you not shoot anyone with your grenade launchers? You've got weapons that can fire, game. Let me fire them. Well, I'm going to jump up here. Yeah, we can't fire. Ah, game, you cheat. <laughs> Friendly thumper artillery coming in. No, we don't lose the shockwave as well. Armor blow through. Internal damage. Another thumper artillery. And they're friendly turret. They're not friendly turrets. Damn. Clive turret's gonna be bad. I'm here. Alright, we have to stay away from our friendly thumper turrets. What are you? Heavy point defense. It's going to be AMS then, isn't it? Thunderbolt emplacement. Let's go for you. Fire in. Mech warriors. Show them Thunderbolts what are not going to be friendly. Not good. So. Ready for orders. Kit Fox. That guy. Confirm. Let's go. Nearly Let's down. Go. Target's taken Why did we have to lose that Good to go. pilot and mech? 
feels like the game is robbing me of a good thing. Attacking from position. That turret is gone. Waiting for orders. Yes. Are we? Why are we not able to fire our weapons? It's not seeing the Centurion as a target. It's seeing everything else, just not the Centurion. Jumping. Interesting. Oh, you're actually taking damage because you're on the mech. Hmm. Something tells me those term. Okay, you did nothing. Why? Yeah, I suppose at the end of the day, I don't care why. I'm going to take you out. I'm on him. No. Reporting. Critical hit. That sucks. Good to go. Heavy point defense. I. I'm gonna go tandem on you, and I'm gonna go vigilance on me. Oh yeah, fire! Acknowledge. Hmm. Oh yeah, good. Nearly took out this turret with that. Centurion is going, but not doing anything. Yeah, that artillery is going to do nothing, apart from level that building. Oh, this guy's going next. Mm, what's in that arm? Oh, they don't like me at all. Nothing, I don't think. Reporting. No. Heavy damage. No. Or oh, is it gone? No. But it's nearly gone. Good to go. Commander. Right, so let's have you hit this turret. Confirm. Let's hit him hard. It's gone. Target destroyed. I'm receiving you. Let's have you. Location confirmed. It's almost pointless firing at anything but the back of you, so. Let's go for the pit bull. Target locked. Come on, people. Let's make it happen. My LRMs are out. I haven't seen you on Twitch. I've always streamed on Twitch, so I am good that people still enjoy me on Twitch. Oh, we jammed one of them. Damn it. Hopefully that's enough still, though. Although... Tandem on you is probably better Roger still. That. It's not quite enough to do damage to take you out, though. Aye, aye. Right, can you... No, since I've done the melee attack, I don't... No, no. Since I got back on, I haven't been able to fire. Captain, thank you for subbing. You are amazing. You can now enjoy ad-free TV or streaming Firing and some emotes and your joint team explosion, which we've had a couple of explosions today. Yeah, you are promoting me exploding my own mechs. Yeah, since I got back on and off, I haven't been able to fire with a battle armor. And you gifted subs. Gifted 10. Are you kidding me? You absolute legends. 
You are crazy. You are literally crazy. You sir are amazing. For that, I will go and blow up all the mechs that I can. Yeah. And I probably will. My mechs, most likely. Um, let's see if we can finish this turret off. Firing on top. Let's hit him hard. Inflicted some heavy damage. <laughs> and what else just come through? Nimble, thank you for subbing on YouTube. You are amazing as well. What Everyone's amazing. And what would be amazing if we survive this without losing anything else? No, we can't go all in. Literally can't go any hot hotter than that. That's why that... If we had spent some time on the Scorpion, we may have not had things go boom today. Well, in this mission. But at the end of the day, we... Tank Ram? You... I mean... Captain, are you piloting that tank? Because that tank might just be crazy. The pilot of that tank is crazy. It just tank rammed us and missed. Okay, we're getting artillery on this, which is next turn. It's going to be dead by next turn, hopefully. I think it just fired now, though. No, it's firing now. Ooh, shoulder right. Both arms are now open. There's nothing in the arms, though. It's nothing. So that's good. Yeah. So that, see, artillery just isn't worth it anymore. Good to go. It just isn't. Standing by. The fact that you can get taken out before you fire. Oh, can I not melee the tank right in front of me? I guess not. Order acknowledged. Yeah, I kind of wish they. Orders. You know what? I'm glad that they did change artillery because artillery was kind of overpowered. But I am sad that they've changed it. On my way. No retreat. Let's hit him hard. We're actually out of streak ammo on the kit fox. Waiting for orders. Well. Heading out. Uh, with the overheating, right? We're not fire that then, because you know, friendly fire and everything. Acknowledged. Let's go. Confirm. Uh, right. Got to stay out of the artillery. We'll go there. Order acknowledged. We're getting toasty. I got you. I know we're hitting the opposite side to everybody else, but orders. Uh, oh no, we can fire. Oh, well, we literally just out of range. Did I deploy too quickly, and that's why? Copy that. Ah, that seems annoying. That I did that. Engaging with target. Ooh, stressed. This guy's going to go. Maybe he'll tank ram again. Uh, the AI is Damn very minimal. scared of the artillery. You don't get much damage out of it, but I found it's good for aerial denial, pushing the enemy in directions. That That's one way to use it. I think I need to get hold of it and use it in a couple of missions and see how well it goes, or how badly it goes, I suppose. Go okay, there, with a kick. We'll go tandem. We'll get through the armor. Move order received. Locked on for physical Maybe. attack. Maybe. Oh. The, the lasers got through the armor. How are you doing, John, anyway? And artillery. Uh, yeah. It is it is good for aerodynamics because it pushes everyone away from a certain area. But that's... You can do... I think mines are actually better. Or they, they were anyway. But 
Mines haven't really changed, but I think mine's going to be more effective now simply because Show what you got. people have realized that yes, Commander. using them means that people don't, or mechs, tanks, don't move as far. Good to go. Uh, Fumper vehicle that also shoots fast cam. Let's make it I use the fast cam instead. That's Mission probably the best thing to use. Mission right, let's see what's left of the lamb. Let's see what's left of my Morrigan. Let's let's just see what's left. Now, if I can get hold of some augmented thunder ammo, I would probably use that quite um, actively. Let me get some money. Fine. Killed in action. The mech is toast. It's not an Omni, though, is it? No. So we have lost the Clan XL engine in there. And the heat and energy battle computers, which is how this mech works. Fine. Maybe we haven't lost it entirely. We shall see. There's a couple of engines. Pitbull. There's the lamp. 55 ton mech. We can take the whole thing. So lamb. Stealth lamb is gone. Meh. Lamb composite structure is probably fixed. That's fine. Sensor sniper, fire control mark two. So radical heat sink double kit, defensive gyro. Lamb double XL clan is gone, sadly. It had a MML risk and machine guns. Hmm. You know what? It's worth taking. One, because it's a lamb, they're quite fun. If we can get all the right stuff in there, then it's good. And light AC 5s. They are also good. LRM 15. So, could be good. Uh, B pods. Why are they not bolt on stuff? Has one use. Uh, this exclusive B pod deals specific and exclusive deals damage specifically exclusive to battle armor. Will activate automatically when attacking battle armor swarms. Can also be activated manually. Has one use. The user is immune to the weapon's area effect damage. Up to 150 area effect damage in the unit. That might actually be worth taking. There's two of them. XL engine. Okay. Warfare suites. Quick sell. Excuse me, I've got hiccups from somewhere. Right, okay. That's what is there. There's some stuff. There is some stuff. Valkyrie is a 60 ton mech. Omni mech. Interesting. Ah, 60 ton Omni. Built in light engine? Okay. Cockpit voice. Plus two initiative. Not bad. Modular weapons. Chassis has Omni slots. This unit's quirk. What? <laughs> so, its quirk is it's an, it's an Omni mech. Okay, game. Okay. Oh, fast camp doesn't go off on friendlies now too. I thought augmented was the oh well, augmented thunder mines were the only mines that you couldn't trigger. But sometimes uh, with artillery, it fired augmented mines, but regular mines still triggered. 
like I don't know. I'd have to I'd have to find every single one and test them out in game to see what actually works. But I mean, if all of them are effectively augmented minds, then brilliant. That's good. I mean, that is not a bad mech. So what hard points have you got? Two ballistic, three missile, and a support. It's missile, well, ballistic is different at least. So I'm thinking light AC5s. Maybe. We need, an, I think an element 15 is going to be useful for the catapults. MML 10 risk. So what MMLs do I have? No risk ones. No. Would love some um, ATMs for the catapults. So give me a 20 in there. If I put two 15s, 20. That give me 50 missiles. One of those would give me 60. Yeah, that's what we need there. One shot long tom. Streak SRM sixes gives me would give me a few of those. Thunderbolt fifteen, mm, Artemis as well could be useful. C three, I've got four of those. A fifth one would be handy. XL engine for some money. Also, my Morrigan isn't on this list. It says it's shooting fast cam, but definitely doesn't explode on my Max. Pretty sure it used to. Yes, it used to. So maybe it has changed, and hopefully it has. Which is awesome. Artemis, not really. Machine gun quarter, that's not, that's not worth picking up. Uh, SRM Artemis clan. Interesting. I have... Ooh, we could go... I don't have any clan. That's good for later on when I get hold of some SRM clans. Interesting. And then LRM clan Artemis. I actually have a few bins of already. I don't actually know what else to take. The active probe could be useful. Does that give us the... It doesn't give us the area ping. No. Damn. I am tempted by the light AC5s. Giving me three of them. Which means we can spam them later on. On a certain mech. Or streaks. I think I'm actually going to take the Artemis Streak SR, not uh, I'm sorry, SRM Artemis Clan ammo because it's fairly rare. But yeah, we'll go with that. Okay, so Morrigan it hasn't gone gone completely. Uh, I will. I have got some goodies in storage now, and. We are gonna we are gonna play with all the st stuff in storage. We've got to we've got to rebuild a few mechs. We've got we've got a few mechs to play with now, and I think in the next stream it will be a more of a building stream than a playing stream, like mission stream. There will still be missions, but. It'll be me playing around with what I've got, trying to make the mechs a, a bit better. We got unlucky with the quad, sorry, with the lamb going for us and flying at us. I think I want to keep the Morrigan though. Be <laughs> Majestic is dead though. We've lost two pilots and a mech today. Let's all have a moment of silence for Majestic. We're done. like two in one stream now we've got to find new pilots because we're running low and there's a lot of affinity there as well which 
it's going to be hard for us to get when we're fighting heavy mechs. F for respect, yes. Yeah. Let's actually take a look at this guy. Let's see what is left of this mech. I mean, the Warfare Suite Mark II is still intact, but I probably don't want it on this mech. Because it's it's too... It was, it's five tons. It annoys me that the... the the turret blew up the XL, the double XL clan LAM engine. So if we put the 275 engine in there, and this, it actually only saves us. Two, seven, eight tons? Wow. Well, yeah, we get. To, we actually get everything else, though. Yes, we lose a lamb turbine. We've got the lamb booster. Fine. I think I'd rather get rid of... See, I've got a risk cockpit in there, and you're covering that with a small advanced. No. Sensor sniper. Not bad. Fire control mark two. Not bad. We need to find an engine for this guy. Um, do I have any lamb stuff. No. I have a chem laser and some quad mechs. Quad, sorry, quad missiles. So in all fairness... Boom. Boom. Done. Are the... Oh, it's light machine gun arrays. Hmm. Yeah, we have a heavy machine gun. What kind of ammo do we have? We have incendiary for regular heavy machine gun. Okay, we have some of that. MMLs could work. If I put a 240 in here. Uh, we're a little bit over tonnage, so the land booster can go. Oh, we're one. Ah, we need 250 to be able to put. Okay, we'd have to drop that. Fine. One, two. Ah, we've got two down here as well. That's good. Did I not pick up a. No, it might have been in my video series. I wonder, can I put that and that? No, I can only put one or the other in there. Fine. That's good to know for later on. Many later ons. What am I doing with this guy, though? Okay, so... Revert... Repair. If I put that 240 engine in there, I'm too heavy because of this. Ah, the land booster gives us the ability to put more um, jump jets in there as well. Interesting. So your movement is four to six. If I take that out, it's still four to six. Seven max jump. That is five max jump. Okay. Yeah, for the moment, I'm just going to repair it. 23 days of repair. I'm most likely going to drop this, if I'm honest. It's weird. It says uh, 0 of 0 because it doesn't have the engine in there. Right. Yes. Yeah, let's just confirm that for now. It looks good. It's a 55-ton mech. 
it does need some stealth realistically and so we got to see how it's changed if if at all it has changed it has clearly changed because pretty sure the booster packs didn't affect right. how many jump jets I'll you can have in the mech game. One thing I will do before we go is put a build onto the catapult now. So we'll put that there. Or should I say finish putting the build on here? That there. Seven tons. Oh, well. Armour. Two and a half tons. So we've got Deadfight LK LK. Endo Steel, XL Engine. We have Advanced Optics Mark 1. It's better than nothing and it helps out somewhat. We've already got Gunnery A and B. I don't think we've gained anything new. I mean, Cockpit is good. Cockpit Interface, I can't put it in there. So we'll put the Com Suite in there. See if any Master Units. It has to go in someone. We're going to find someone that that can go in. And then we're going to use it. So we're going to start putting slave units in everyone. Uh, don't need any of that because we've got the AR-14. Don't think we need multi-track. You know, the one thing I would like in this, to be fair, is... Oh, Battle Computer Missile. And Artemis would be also be pretty good. But let's see what LRM ammo we can put in here. Half mag pulse would be good. Swarm Inferno or sw is that Swarm Improved? Improved. No. Uh, I don't think Tandem's worth it. It's only 80 missiles. Ooh, I've actually got Thunder Augmented. Half. Well, let's put that in. And I've got half a ton left. I kind of want incendiary in there, but Magpulse is good enough, I suppose. Regular half bin, I suppose, is good. Unless I've got a half LK. <gasps> Sam. Sam missiles. You know what? Deadfire is probably not going to get used, in all fairness. So let's put that in there. I've still got half a bin. Chaff could be useful. But no, let's just go with regular half bin. 70 tons? Kind of do want to put... That in there. Give me one and a half more tons? One and a half more tons. What could we put in there for that? You know what, I could strip half a ton of armor and put the C3 master unit in here. Let's do that. Let us give us the master unit. 32 days. That's because we're putting so much armor onto this. Yeah, we've got the C3 network started. Now every mech needs it. On it. On it. Uh, the boosters were real good before. Last patch, not sure now. Okay, so, well, we're going to be building up the Wackion. And hopefully it's going to be good. Right, Thunderbolt is good so kit box did you actually take any damage in that one no I don't think you did interesting nor did the scorpion take any damage interesting everyone else did uh, I don't want to look at this one right now I want to forget about how brutalized it got and we're going to come back and deal with it next time but Let's spend the last few minutes clearing out all the garbage. Actually, there isn't much garbage in all fairness. No. No, I think we're good. Fine. 
One last thing. Let's check the soil. I should have checked this before building the catapults. Because now I'm going to find a N launcher. No, but there's uh, high explosive bombs. I don't have any bomb bays, though. You know what? I will buy them for when we get them. I'll buy four of them. New equipment available. And then the Curitan store has a couple of avatar parts, full avatars. I don't necessarily like avatars, if I'm honest. Uh, Lambo's the 80% sword. No. No, I think we're good. I've actually just thought of how we can play with the Lambmech. We got a load of charge uh, spiked equipment earlier, so we can make it into a charging mech. I have no idea how that would affect anything. But we've got to give it a go, right? we got to turn our lamb into a charging mech. That could work. It could also fail miserably. But we will have to give that a try. We are now going to have to look at paying our technicians a full wage so that we can get all of our mechs up and running. We got f four mechs that need to come to life. Um, yeah. Obviously, rebuilds, new builds. That's going to happen. That's already got the build. That's already got a build. And then all of the these guys. But it is all next time. So, more crew members. <laughs> yeah, we do need... We also Yeah, we could also get some people from the barracks not the barracks the hiring hall they have technician we are going to need a couple to be fair boot camp you'll know caskets now wants to join us by the way dumpling is a battle armor pilot ghost is also a battle armor pilot you're nothing gonzo is a lamb pilot interesting He's also ab absolutely terrible otherwise. You're a technician. You're a VTOL pilot. Punisher is ex-military with assassin. That's not bad, okay, actually. Help. Let's hire you. New I suppose... Available. The problem is you've got a call and vent, which really, really is not needed. You've also got... Hard gate case minus 15% stability damage taken. Not bad for a land pilot and focus fire. Oh, yeah. You know what? We need a pilot. Even if you die at some point or we get rid of you, we're still going to be able to field New mech our lamb to begin with. Yeah, probably getting evasion is uh, escapist is probably better. But anyway, that will do it for tonight's. Uh, it will either be really good or really bad. Yes, that's the problem. It'll be really, really good. And then I'll field it again and again and again. Eventually, it'll go boom in my face. Literally. The pilot will probably charge his head into someone's fist. Most likely. So, yeah. I don't think there's anything else I need to do before we go offline. I don't think we do. So yes, I will say thank you. Thank you, Captain, for being amazing. You're being crazy, being a legend, being being yourself, basically. And thank you, everyone else, for stopping by. You are also amazing. And thank you... Who was it? Nimble for the YouTube subscription. You are also amazing. I shall see you all Tuesday. I want to play some Mega Online because I've got a lot of new mechs and I want to... Try and get some builds going on them. So I can make some YouTube videos and stuff. And then I'm working. So that's Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. I'm working. I'm pretty, I'm off uh, next weekend as well. Hmm, I've got a lot of weekends off at the moment. Which is good. And I'll probably stream Friday and Saturday. 
maybe take Sunday off. Or I might take Friday off. Depends how I feel after my next two, after this week of working, basically. But I will definitely be streaming at some point over next weekend. I will just figure it out and I will surprise you all. But for tonight, we are done. We've lost two pilots. We've lost a mech. We've lost half a mech, but we have gained some very interesting mechs that we're going to be fielding. So thank you all for stopping by, and I will see you again very soon for some more mech destruction.